No. We'll do it live! Fuck it! Do it live! I can, I'll write it and we'll do it live! Right. Fucking thing sucks! What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to... to Friday Night! Raiders Lost Flicks Live! And we're ready to watch some trash. We're, we're, we're taking it back to the old Skinamax days. Uh, my partner in crime, Alex, my consigliere, Lincoln X7. Show me on the doll where Ruby Rose touched you, Pete. <laughs> <laughs> the man with the plan, big man, money, Nicotan. I'm here to play. I'm, I'm here to play for keeps people. It's going down for real. And of course, the enforcer, my brother from another mother, he took a cooey on. Ladies and gentlemen, I implore you, do not judge me by the content of the bottle that I drinketh from, but only the cup from which I sippeth. I'm E. Tepo Cooey, and the place to be reviews, and I'm on Raiders of the Lost Flicks live Friday night with all of yous, you sexy son of a bitches. Welcome. <laughs> so we got four of us tonight, and I, I'm kind of hoping we can roll with this four for a while. At least, you know, I'm glad to have Alex back. At least got him out of yeah, retirement. He dusted good. off the Jordans. Nick, you I did a good it. job. You did a good enough job. You get to stay, even though Alex is back. <laughs> really, you guys? You guys like me? I, I get to stay. <laughs> You're a permanent. You're, they love fan. me. They really you love congratulations. me. You congratulations. Every time Beerus in the house, ladies and gentlemen. Look, the only <laughs> way out of this now is through Velocipaster. Oh, oh I was I was gonna say, no. do, do you meet what are we gonna say? Car of uh, 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 what is it? A wooden box like the i nines? It's a fucking pine yeah. box, buddy. Okay, first of all, that's the easy way out. Okay, that's the easy way. I wish I went out in a wooden pine box when I saw Black Christmas. Oh God, I bought it back. <laughs> what are you doing? Hey Pete, I dare you to go to the grocery store and get one of those big like French loaf breads and put like one on the top and one on the bottom and pretend to eat it. <laughs> Come on, drink, plain drink. He doesn't want any. This is more He's, for Admiral Tiberius. We were talking about this earlier, so I had to. I had to. I had to starting to, early. I had to throw it on camera. Uh, so we got a good show for you. Last week was a big hit with Hard Ticket to Hawaii, and tonight's Picasso Trigger is the direct sequel to Hard Ticket to Hawaii. So the same ladies are in it. I don't remember if they're like the stars of this one, but they're there. Like they're, they're all there. There's oh. tits. I'm fine. Well, uh, both pairs are there. So I that's that's all we're gonna say. So if you liked what we had last week, we're gonna have more of that. Admiral Tiberius says, Adam, some friends of mine in the adult entertainment industry want you in a movie with the hat, and they want to call it Raiders of the Lost Poon. Tell them to call me. I'm not against the idea. Oh shit, man! That dude, that's yeah, that's fucking awesome. <laughs> you don't want to have to blow the dust off the poon, though. Also. It, <laughs> If they know some more like softcore shit that we can show or like you know have watch parties for on YouTube, tell uh, send those links our way too because we kind of like the direction that we're going in. Wait, you, so you, you got a Patreon, Adam? We could do some fucking. Uh, I'm just saying. I'm just saying, man. If, if he's got some adult entertainment industry friends, as long as they're not dudes, I mean, we could do some really cool shit on Patreon. That's all I'm saying, man. I mean, yeah. I have I have access to to a lot of Aaron Brown Misty Monday movies. I'm oh. just saying. I'm I need to I need saying. to talk to you about getting me some of those Misty Monday movies that I accidentally lost, by the way. So, <laughs> uh, especially Spider Babe, and I think the one's called Plan of the Playmates of the Playmates. Yeah, playmates of, of the the the, the playmate Planet of the, the apes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely. The Planet of the apes one's fucking hilarious. I I, I have the uh, the Lord of the G strings one. I still have that, but I don't you have. Oh my god, dude! That dude, Lord of the G strings is worth so much money right now. <laughs> I still have that one digital, so we're good there. But I still oh, need man. to. I, I need to get the other ones back. Didn't she uh, do a Tomb Raider one too? Yeah, yes, that one's yes, not as did. good. It's kind of yes, it's a little bit shorter, but it, it's. It's one of the earlier ones, but the the later ones they started putting a little bit more production value into them. They got funnier as time went on. So yeah, I think I think I have her show lingerie that was on Showtime for two seasons. I think I have that. Uh, Spider Babes, my personal favorite. So Dude, Spider I'll, Babes, I'll, awesome. That's my second favorite to the the Sam Raimi movie, and then Spider Babe, and then all the other oh, Spider yeah. Man. Just kind of. That's accurate. That's accurate. It's accurate. So speaking of accurate, uh, what do you got for us for this week on Tubi, Alex? All right, this one's kind of a funny one. I had one choice, and then I was going to pick the second choice, 
but I didn't get to finish the second choice in time. So that will be for next week. I promise that will be a better one. This week, I ended up going with the first choice, which was The Taken of Deborah Logan. And it's uh, directed by, I'm probably going to butcher this name, Adam Robitel. I keep wanting to say Robitussin. It might be Robotai, actually. Robotai? Robotai. Yeah, it might be Robotai. Hentai? Is, is he is he Canadian or uh, French? If it's if he's French or Canadian, it's Robotai. I, I don't know. I only know that because I watch <laughs> hockey all the time. Luke, yeah. Luke Robotai. Yeah. There's nothing too special about this movie. It's just it's film footage film. This crew comes in to film this lady who has Alzheimer's. At least that's what you think she has. But you, you know how these things work. She's possessed by a demon. You know you, you know how this plays out. She's possessed by a demon. Freaky shit happened. But there's one thing about this movie that made it stand out to me from any other found footage film. There's a scene like kind of halfway in the movie near the beginning where the cameraman says, fuck this shit. I'm going home. He gets in his car. He leaves and he never comes back. Smartest person in the found footage film. He got out of there. I was sitting, I was like, okay, you, that's kind of cool. Like I said, there's not much I can say about it. I don't think it's a bad movie. It, it's okay. I mean, it's not the greatest. It's found footage. Once you've seen one, you've seen them all. It's not it's not <laughs> unfriended, but it's like way better than... I can't even think of one. It's a decent found footage film. Like I said, I kind of had a second one I was going to do, but I didn't finish it because I got busy. But I promise you, next week... Next week is going to be so awesome. You might kick me off the show for it. It's going to be ridiculous. <clears throat> nah, I ain't going to kick you off damn. the show. And I'll, oh, I'll give you a hint. Michelle Rodriguez. That's all I'm going to say for next week. Ooh, episode. you have my interest, sir. I like Michelle Rodriguez like mm-hmm. a lot. Oh, you're really going to like next week. Awesome. So you, like, you have my interest already. Um, yeah. So it's, let me ask you this. Is mm-hmm. Hillary Clinton here uh, that, that's on the cover? Is she in the movie or is that just the cover? That is her. And she does start to look that creepy towards the end. This yeah. is actually not... She looks okay in the beginning. She just looks like an old grandmom that you see in some cre- uh, creepy porno. Oh, wait. I'm talking about my... Oh, let me delete my history. <laughs> no kink okay. shame now. No kink shame. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you've seen one film, footage film. You've seen them all. You saw Paranormal Activity. Th- this is it. But like I said, I did like the part about the cameraman because usually the cameraman always dies in these movies. Like, no. The cameraman just says... He pulls a cartman. He says, fuck this shit. I'm going home. And pretty much the rest of the movie, it's the director who has to film it. The cameraman <laughs> never comes back. He One never of my favorite, co- uh, my favorite found footage films is uh, Troll Hunter. That movie is uh, entirely I dubbed, and I don't care. I, I have no problem with no. The, the captions on that one. I made the mistake. You told me about that movie once, and I made the mistake when I tried to look it up. I was about to judge you because I found a cartoon on no, Netflix. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, there's a there's a troll hunter on Netflix. It's definitely a found yeah. footage, and it's it's really fucking good. Yeah, so I give it a three. It's harmless. It's just short film. If you like found footage, check it out. It's one of the better ones. It's not great, but and like I said, I promise next week you're gonna like next week. Next All week right. I found a ridiculous one. <laughs> sometimes you have time and sometimes you don't but yeah I, well i think i don't know if i've seen this one or not i it sounds familiar there's a lot of them that kind of came out like back to back like yeah. with the position stuff so i will be honest i mainly watched it because like you pointed out the creepy old woman just really disturbed me yeah she definitely looks like hillary clinton man that's not <laughs> Ooh. You keep joking like that, you're gonna uh, you're gonna commit suicide there, buddy. No, not me, man. <laughs> there, there's other things I could find first. <laughs> Where the hell is the chat at tonight? I mean, Admiral Tiberius, I'm glad you're at least on time. Everybody else must be like forgot to set their watch or something. So drinking that white claw. Did did there's, I uh there's did no I did I forget about a uh daylight savings time or something? It is still eight thirty, right? Did, did they change it again? Yeah. Did they change it again? Did they abolish it? Son Did they go back bitch. to the old time? <laughs> I'm busting maybe out just, my old timey candle. <laughs> maybe they just maybe they just don't like our movie. I don't know. Do, do I sound like I'm about old time radio? You sound like you want to blow up Gotham City and kill Batman. And, and what has he had? I want you to tell him what he has had. God damn it! It was a Butterfinger edible. I already told you what I had had. Disco Godfather. <laughs> uh, <laughs> But check this out. We're just a few shy of 500, and I'm, I'm trying 
desperately to, well, not desperately, but I just want to get to 500 by the end of the year. But as a reward, once we get to 500 subscribers, we're going to do something crazy on this channel. I'll give you, a, well, first of all, these guys are going to get completely obliterated, like just completely just demolished, drunk, high, whatever. And then we're going to watch this show. I did not hit her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not hit her. I did not. Oh, hi, Mark. We've been teasing it for years, and it's about time that that's the one, I think. I think that would be the special one for the 500s. What, what do you guys think? It's about to go down. Oh, I'm looking forward to it. All right. Uh, see. So, Admiral Tiberius says, I ran out of porn. That's why I'm here. Well, this is at least softcore, so we're not going to completely let you down. I would have thought at least Keely Chow would have been here by now. Damn it. He's probably he's, he's, uh, he's, he's probably uh, out um, trying to uh, hate watch Discovery Family. <laughs> I don't know if this is one of the times he listed that Discovery Family sucks because he's pretty specific about the time slots. So, so it's like eight o'clock something, right? On a yep. Sunday. <laughs> this this could be. Or he's uh he's trying to hang up the flag I sent him. I'm not sure. Or maybe he's conflicted because the Jessica Alba movie is on. He's on he's trying he's watching what is that? Um uh god damn it. Fantastic Four? No, the dancing movie. Honey. He's watching Honey. Honey. He's watching Honey, that's what it is. <laughs> All right, so I put a link up in the description. Now you can go to YouTube right now and just type in Picasso Trigger. It's not very hard to find. It's not like you know, uh, there's only one link, and it's, this one's not very good. They're all pretty much the same movie, same timestamps, and everything. So just find it. I'll give you guys a couple of minutes, and I'm going to actually watch it on Amazon because I, that's what I pay for it for. So let me use it. You just want to see HD titties. Damn oh. right I do. I, I, I dare. I, damn right I do. <laughs> All right. Those are the so. titties of someone's daughter, good sir. Well, you know, it's uh, they're they're, oh. they're meant to be enjoyed by the world. So <laughs> that sounds like a conversation me and Tony Tone Deaf were having earlier. Sexist men. Sexist men. All right. So I'm gonna single up here, and we're gonna get the. Uh, the clapper ready. So does everybody have your links pulled up now and, and you're ready? I'm ready for the clap. All right. So <laughs> from five, five, four, three, two, one. Malibu Bay film. Okay. Oh, okay. We just get straight to the, okay. We get straight to the uh, title. This movie's not playing around. Yeah, they don't fuck yeah, around, man. Yeah. I mean, if you show me some tits Bond, in the first minute. Steve Bond. I want <laughs> you say you got Steve Bond is Gold Bond in this too. <laughs> gold Bond. Coming Something next. Long? <laughs> Harold Diamond. <laughs> oh my god. Ah, Pantera. Roberta Vasquez. There Ooh. you go. There you go. Guich Kook. This is the <laughs> this is starting like a horror movie, like there's panning over weird shit. Cynthia <laughs> Bremhall. Rodrigo Obron. Rodrigo Obron Johnny. And John Apria is Picasso as, Trigger. It's Picasso Trigger. I'm going to offend a lot of people trying to pronounce these names. On. Howard Wexler sounds like the dean of a college who's just an asshole. <laughs> you, mean, you mean Urban Legend? <laughs> D D is that Ooh. the dean's name? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wexler was, it, Wexler was the guy's name. It was uh, Robert England, remember? Oh, shit. Well, no, 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 sorry. No, no, sorry. Robert England was the teacher who named Wexler. Oh, I was. I have not seen Urban Legend in a long time. I just found I have. Er, I have, uh, found the DVD of Urban Legend Final Cut. I didn't even know I had it. Oh Jesus! That, that, that like <laughs> the first one's so much fun, and like they could have gone so well. And the second one's like really dog shit because it's like this, this guy's killing these student filmmakers over over a student Oscar. Yes, it's like nobody kills anybody over a student film. It's a student film. Like it's supposed to be <laughs> shitty. Did you ever see the third one? Yes. They, oh God, no. There's even they a fourth a one. one oh my God! I didn't know there was a fourth one. Yeah, when the third the one went supernatural, it was like Bloody Mary. Yeah, I think there was a fourth one as well. Oh, no. Okay, that's clearly the house of an 80s villain, action movie villain. This is that Pentangle. Is the of the villain. It's Pentangle. <gasps> Whereabouts oh are God. you guys? Give me some timestamps. Uh, I am at two, two minutes. minutes exactly. Yep. Okay. Hi, I have some papers for Mr. Glastonbury. I'm sorry, he's dead. We'll give these to one of his associates. <laughs> God, I knew Pentangle was responsible for this. 
God Always pentangle. I'm waiting to see one of the guys that played one of the FBI agents in uh, in that movie. In the end, show up as like a villain in another movie. That'll reaffirm that Pentangles fucking has vast reach through every genre of movie. Where there's a villain, you'll find Pentangle. Is that Salman Rushdie on TV? No, his name's Sal Bass. <laughs> Yeah, the guy's pants pulled up to his belly button. All right. Damn, I did he get his heart? This fucking did he get his right. heart taken out or something? What the hell's going on? <laughs> That's the uh, he joined the zipper club. He had a five way. He had a he had a bypass. Jeez, he had an eight way bypass. <laughs> He's a robot now. His heart just hums. <laughs> his heart just hums when they when he put the stuff that goes up next to it. It's just like hmm. <laughs> Uh, give me one more timestamp, somebody. Uh, three twenty. Okay. <laughs> Close enough. And I, I, I know this is this isn't about uh, Picasso Trigger, but I'm reading the Urban Legend w- uh, wiki page, and it said in, Feb- in February 2020, a reboot of the film announced as its development. Oh God! A reboot of Picasso Trigger? No, of of, of Urban Legend. Sorry. <sighs> oh, okay, I was gonna say <laughs> why. Why, Lord? Why would you do that? I don't know. I, I, like... I, I would be shocked if it. I, I know there's sequels to Andy Sedaris movies being planned, but reboots? No. Um, no. <laughs> the next, uh, it says up now on my up next here, the next movie is a YouTube movie. It's free. You know what movie it is? What? The, the Wraith. Oh, that's a good one. That the, movie's a, The Wraith with Charlie Sheen. Yeah, the Wraith oh, is awesome. Okay, I have okay. that on DVD. <laughs> Oh my god! I, I I've never just like come across that movie. I need to buy. That's one I need to just order. I love that. I watched that as a kid. I was like, I love this movie. I don't know why, but I love it. Oh, you gotta take them stairs if they're driving in a sidecar motorcycle. <laughs> I mean, my god, that's like a pussy mobile right there. <laughs> save, 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 some, save some pussy for the rest of us, yo. <laughs> driving on the lawn and shit. Oh, they think you are, man. Fuck, <laughs> fuck your grass. Park Those Catherine Bell tatas. Oh, Admiral Tiberius, I love that woman. Oh, oh yeah, I, yeah. I thanks for the, Bell. Thank, yeah. thanks for that today, Admiral Tiberius. By the way. Yep, I I, uh, I, I found that fappening photos set of photos. <laughs> Wait, are these like actual leak nudes? Yes. Yeah. Catherine Bell. Well, yeah. I'll hook you up after the show. I'll be right back. <laughs> no, you won't. <laughs> I will be right back. I know. I'm like put my li- put my living room back together because I got new carpet today. And Admiral Tiberius is setting me. Met, we're we're talking back and forth, and he's like, "Oh yeah, here's some Catherine Bell pictures." I'm like, "God damn it!" And I'm not getting anything done for the next at least two to three Let me minutes. Yes, this. Did you go crazy on the old <laughs> carpet before they ripped it up? Did you? Just- no, I I didn't. I knew we were, you know, I knew we were getting this. Like, I literally have not vacuumed in like three days, and I have nice. a dog and a cat, and it, I vacuum like twice a day. So, it was like, <laughs> ooh, I, I just someone's yeah. been a bad witch. I like to live dangerously. Hey, uh, uh, Admiral Tiberius, uh, look me up after the show and uh, send that my way too, if you don't mind. <laughs> she got like the landing strip. It looks like. Oh, movie. Yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah I was going to say, are we narrating what's on screen or do we get pictures? Um, <laughs> you know, the funny thing about Andy Sedaris is he's taking these, like, not actresses and trying to make a real movie. And that's kind of why these are funny. It's like, you know, you can't act. Just take your shirt off. Man, James Bond really let himself go. <laughs> but yeah, I'm pretty sure Sedaris was a really big James Bond fan. But which Daniel oh, yeah, Craig? Dude. He liked he liked he liked Bond. He liked Rambo. He liked all that shit. That's why he made yeah. his movies. Ram, I'm surprised he just didn't come straight out and make a Rambimbo. I'm I'm actually going to rent Last Blood tomorrow. I'm pretty night. sure that exists. I'm pretty I'm sure. No, I think I think I think I think I think, uh, I, I think Wynorski made that one too. <laughs> nice word, Wynorski. Yeah. Ram Bimbo. I'm pretty sure that exists. Pretty sure. Well, if if you ever watch the uh, what is it, the documentary called Papatopoulos about Jim Wynorski, he's making um, what the fuck is it, the Bear Wench Project in three days. I've seen that. 
Yeah, dude, it's it's crazy. He has like he's like a sound guy and a cameraman, and he makes his movie in three days. Is this guy shooting him with a World War One fucking rifle? Yeah, an M M one Grand. Jesus. Oh, Woo! he go. He had spray paint behind his head. Huh. Didn't even know that. So he rolled up in a sidecar and did it. No did mask, fucking... nothing. Just you know, these are pentangle style villains. Yep. Just no fucks given. He don't care. Meanwhile, man. back at the plantation. <laughs> they will find Steve James. <laughs> Ala Moana Yacht Club, Honolulu, Hawaii. Moana. Wait, is that a connection to fucking what was that movie? The cartoon movie with the Rock, Moana. Yeah, Moana. Yep. See. Oh dear God, no! What the no, fuck? No. Oh Jesus! No. Not cool, dude. Not cool. What are you doing? No, what satellite ass phone does he have? What Holy kind of weird, shit! What kind of weird shit is this? Hello, dude, that's some fucking Doctor Claw Evil. shit right there. Dude, 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 that's Tubbs that's... is rocking the technology, man. Hang on a That's second. That's Zach Moore's phone. Gadget. Call me on the satellite. Dude, this guy phone. ought to get sued by there you David go, there you go, Pete. <laughs> <laughs> I'll is get you next drink- time. No, wait. Is he drinking the coffee or the orange juice? Pick one, man. You're being indecisive. You can't mix them. I've tried. L- listen, listen. He's trying to hydrate and caffeinate, all right? Don't you can't do it. It doesn't work. Don't shame the man for trying I've, to be healthy. I've okay, tried. In the 80s. I know. <laughs> I will shame him for being friends with a guy who walks around in a green speedo. Okay. <laughs> fair enough. Fair enough. I know we said no kink shaming, but this is no, different. That, that's kink shaming. <laughs> yeah, this that this is my different. Kink. Yeah, that's not no. My kink. Actually, no, it's not kink shaming. Biggest? No one's. It's not kink shaming. No yeah, one's getting turned on by that. No one's getting turned on by that. I oh. went from Hawaii to Vegas. What the fuck? All right, now I just want to say something right here. If you go all the way to Vegas and you watch a show like this, you're doing it wrong. That's all. One hundred percent, man. One hundred percent. This I is wanna, like you better be this, shooting fucking uh like yeah something this, out of that fucking hook. Oh, I mean, <laughs> this is like the is budget, that Terry Crews with show. hair. Yeah, that's a Cineo Hall. He got jacked. I say that looked like Terry Crews with <laughs> a hair <laughs> curl, <laughs> dude. That's just that's Cineo Hall with with who got jacked, and he's like he's like clap, motherfuckers. <laughs> oh snap, that's Shawn Michaels. <laughs> I think I'm cute. I know I'm. I think sexy. that's Danny Sedaris again. It is. That, that, is, that is. that is him right Ladies there. This gentleman, Andy Sedaris, right there. Hold uh, no, 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 no. Why didn't them girls take them tops off? What, what happened? Give it time. Don't honey dick me, movie. Look, he's like, you want to start and roll? <laughs> that's Patience, nice. Simone Frere. <laughs> Are you sure that's Shawn Michaels? That's more like Dolph Ziggler. It's he's Dolph Michaels. A, okay, it's Dolph Michaels. He's got a tiny face. Like, look at his face. It looks tiny. That dude I don't looks know like Jason it, Mews. Well, I don't know what it is. Like the what? guy, the, if the guy next to him just has a big fat head, or if like he has a tiny face. I mean, I think it's a little bit of both. If you ever look I, at, if you ever look at, um, what was it, D- Derek Mears or whatever? Um, he's got alopecia. He doesn't have any eyebrows. Oh god! But in all seriousness, I've been to Vegas my many times. In my turtleneck. This show that they're watching. This is the <laughs> scam ship show. Like you know, around three o'clock in the morning. <laughs> yeah, it is. Lonely Island, Lonely Island bit this man. Dude, style. I, dude, I, I haven't, I haven't been to Vegas. What, in probably five, probably probably about ten years, man. I need to Not go for back. a while, but the whole time I was at GameStop, I went every, almost every year, except for the two years that we didn't do a uh, conference in Vegas. Oh, what, what, what did you go to? Uh, CES or whatever. Usually, we went to Mandalay Bay. No, oh, it's uh, it was a managers conference, uh, okay. GameStop managers conference, which is like a <clears throat> mini E four or E three. Oh, nice, nice. Yeah, and they would they would uh, all the all the the major companies would like spoil us and try to get us to sell our products and shit and treat us some, treat us to some stuff. Yeah, I know a friend of mine works out there. She works for uh, Cirque du Soleil. She's a makeup artist for them. Why is it the only ass I've seen so far? Is Speedo guy. Uh, this guy with the V-neck is offending me. <laughs> He's got like, the deep. The, the like deep I, I wore deep. some bullshit turtlenecks in the nineties too, man. But nothing that's a that V-neck. Bad. You know, I thought that was a gold chain. No, me too. That's how come I was. That's how come I was making a Lonely Island joke, but it was a chain. My <laughs> turtleneck and chain, gold chain. <laughs> if you this wear fucking a gold guy chain, looks like the guy from Trailer neck. Park Boys. Who bubbles? Yeah. <sighs> fucking hey, boys! I'm gonna go get me a fucking kitty. <laughs> And Tangle made those girls cover up. The so most evil thing they can do. Jeez, I love this fucking music, man. So glad I got these movies in Blu-ray. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I 
<laughs> I told you to just buy the DVD, damn yeah, it. Yeah, dude. Well, listen, man. I, I, I need, I, I, need, quality, I need quality nipple, <laughs> goddammit. You quality. ordered this shit before I could even finish this show. I'm like, I'll send you the link to the DVD. I'm too late. I already ordered it. I'm like, I... <laughs> I wanted the Blu-ray. I want, I want them in, in HD. Same. I'm pretty sure the Blu-ray you get is going to be the exact same print as you get on the DVD. <laughs> I'll be pissed off if it is. I'll be real pissed off. If it I, is. I don't think any Shout Factory type effort was put into restoring those motherfuckers. I'm just saying. you're probably right, man. At least yeah, <laughs> yeah, because at least Shout Factory will like get get like four negatives and like oh you know, yeah, Shout, together Shout, Shout then, like, Factory gives those movies way more attention than they than they uh, uh, they, they do a great job. So does uh, so does Synapse, man. Synapse does an amazing job. I know they yeah. they 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 did. Um, popcorn like two years ago hey, and keely was... chow is here keely chow congratulations he's our new moderator on this channel hey buddy what's up man you Hail fucking deserved keely it buddy you, you earned that wrench sir welcome to the party pal yep <laughs> welcome to the big dick club hey keely chow did your delivery come keely today chow. man did you get it did you get something in the mail today what did you send him uh oh he won uh he won my first uh giveaway Oh, nice! So he congratulations. Got, he got a uh, he got a 1998 still in the uh, still in the wrapper NWO Wolfpack flag. Oh uh, shit! Pl place to be review right. sticker. And by the way, I didn't forget you, Tony Tone Deaf. Welcome to the party, buddy. And uh, welcome, Tone. Autographed uh, autographed Pete Daddy dollar vintage fucking trading card. All right, recognize Whoa. any of the guns because. Uh, Andy okay. here doesn't spend a lot of money on gun props. Okay, he lost. That's clearly Dolph Ziggler. <laughs> but at least they blow shit up. He had to do the they job. They did not give me titties. It's it's Dolph. He had to put somebody else over. Yeah, that's how Dolph does. He did all the work and then put them over. <laughs> all of a sudden, I feel like mint chip, mint, mint, uh, mint chip ice cream. Yeah, me too. Girl, you way too dressed to be in this movie. God damn, you look like Fran Drescher. Just don't talk. No shit. <laughs> Wait, is that the guy from the... No. Okay, never mind. Your Fran, Drescher's, your Fran Drescher's meth whore cousin. That shirt is offensive. No, don't lie, Pete. You know you, you pay good money to hear Fran Drescher read an audio erotic book. I think it would be funny, so yes, I would. I want her. <laughs> I would like you to take me in a night on the opera. <laughs> I want her and Gilbert Gottfried to read Fifty Shades of Grey. That's what I want. Oh my god! <laughs> Do Gilbert oh Gottfried reading anything? No, let's let's see. Fuck it, Nick. Let's see her and Gilbert Gottfried uh, reenact. Dude, you fuckers remember we'll you shoot the movie. Night? Oh my god. <laughs> oh oh no, 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 dude. No. I remember I remember I remember up all night. Yeah, dude. I yep. love that shit. No, no, it, was, no. it was it was it was it was all it was almost gonna max for USA. Mm -hmm. what, I'm what, Gilbert like, Gottfried. We're doing USA a full night movies. What, what was it? Nikita La Femme Nikita and shit like that they kept showing oh, and oh, fuck, red I shoe diaries that. and stuff. I love La Femme Nikita. Holy are shit. These are these bad guys from Cobra Kai? No, I, I thought that was uh Fred from the fucking mystery machine. <laughs> <laughs> like he must have got kicked out of the fucking gang. <laughs> why did he steal the why did he steal the arms of the shirt from the other guy? Either that or it's Bam Bam grown up. <laughs> Uncle Uncle Rico? What? Oh, I'm horny. <laughs> Look here, Dame. Stems she like that. Like she's wearing a green screen. <laughs> Oh my god! We well, in that, case, be seen, bro. in that case, I'm going to do some mocap. Yeah, right. <laughs> Bill and Ted went down a dark path. Jesus. Oh, that is such a pentangle move. No. Oh snap! Oh, never mind. Damn, man, she almost got the drawdown too. I was gonna say that was gonna be kind of gangster. She shot them, but no. Yeah, she went shot him around the dick like fucking Robocop. Bam. Yeah. <laughs> so what? What was the second guy doing there? Like, what was he for? Because I would just shoot him in the face. I'd be like, wait, I think I, this no is, witnesses. This, this movie is secretly the demo reel for uh, uh, Street Fighter, the movie. Hey, is that Frankie Avalon with that hair? <laughs> why oh why oh why oh did I ever leave Ohio? Nobody. Oh snap! 
I was he does look say, like Napoleon Dynamite. If if anybody if anybody <laughs> picked if anybody picked a Yo did I ever leave Ohio reference up, I'll give you bonus points for that. <laughs> no, I know a there we go. Michello. So I was gonna say, have you seen Back to the Beach then? Oh come on, no, t- titties, I just titties. know that from Michella. Titties. All right, let's see these things. Unleash those fuckers. Unleash the Kraken. Yeah, she's probably got a fucking bush like a Kraken, too. Let <laughs> don't care, the kids me. out. Let them out. Let them out. <laughs> free the puppies. Woohoo! Come on, free the tatas. <laughs> they need air. <laughs> they need air. There's the cane in there. Okay, there we go. Let the hair down first. Now, now smell her okay, a little bit. Nice. Just, just yes. Me. There we go. Come on. Don't, don't you sense? It. Don't you sense it? There we go. We have boobs. There, there we go. the other girl get in there with her so they can take a shower together? Yep, let that happen. And they have a pillow fight in the shower because they need to conserve water. You know, it's 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 a boat that doesn't yeah. have a lot of a lot of water on there. Wait, does this I'm mean we're also energy conscious on this show? There's there's <laughs> this is a boat and we have hose. Uh, y- 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 yes, sir. I think I think Boats this count is, as Boats as as, as hose. I have exercised the demons. Oh God! What, what, what is it? A, what, what is it about a, a body glove? Uh, fucking, yes. What swimsuit? Yes. So how come one takes a shower and the other one doesn't? So she's stinky. You have to take a shower to get everyone... in the fucking disgusting ocean water that's filled with oil and toxic yeah, waste. Yeah, that's kind of right. kind of anticlim- You know, kinda... why does everyone keep wearing a green screen in this movie? <laughs> I, I don't know. Maybe they thought they were going to superimpose some dirtier shots. I don't know. Green screen, pink screen at this scene. It's all right. It's all good. It's all the same market. Uh, excuse me. Diddy, you're driving the wrong way. Boy, Diddy and Biggie changed from the hypnotized video. Now it's Andy <laughs> the Sedaris film. There we go. Radio with control Hawk, vehicle. <laughs> hey, hey, you shot what uh, works. The- <gasps> oh, 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 that oh. That no sensei. He's going to kamikaze that motherfucker. <laughs> On, you're not off. wrong you're not wrong <laughs> it's at not all racist at all is it <laughs> wax no on, wax not off. when it's the truth because he's gonna kamikaze that plane right into a fucking thing if he starts yelling really loud oh my god weird. they're gonna go pearl harbor we'll see we'll see you, you, glove, can't, ladies you, and gentlemen. you can't you can't make that joke because uh what is it Morty tried to make the joke and people hated them for that so you can't you make did? that joke Rick and Morty made that joke in the recent episode. Did they? They did. They, oh, they're, 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 they're like, they're, they're like, oh, we, we shouldn't go 9 11, but we'll go Pearl Harbor, though. Pearl Harbor's fine. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> okay, are you trying to get, get some speed? What are, you, what are you doing, man? You know, I'm starting he's to gonna crash he's the boat. It's not going to really have the effect that you think it's going to, buddy. It's a well, very it's clearly a toy boat, boat that superimposed. Oh, of course, this, of course, there's some plastic explosive in there. This is like sure. space 1999 fucking props. I've got my white laser suit on. Oh God, <laughs> this is going to get ridiculous, isn't it? Do it do there it you now. go. Was that your first cell phone, Pete? That was mine. Almost. I could kill somebody dude, with my first dude, cell phone. My, my, so my first cell phone was a, was a black Motorola StarTac. Oh, dude, I had one of those. That was my second one. That <laughs> was my second Nikia. one was a StarTac. I had the old Nikia with the snake game on it. Oh, there you go. They there did it. Is. Pearl Harbor's been reenacted. I am so offended right now. Andy Bob Ross is it? Bob Ross is the villain in this. <laughs> When was Bob Ross? Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna put I'm some trees confused. where that boat was. Some happy you, little trees. You didn't use aluminum siding. <laughs> Bob Ross getting sick and tired of everyone thinking he's weak because he's happy all the time. Bob Ross gonna choke a bitch. Does Bob Ross have to blow a bitch's boat up? Look, Rolling, they're going back to fucking uh, Michael Dudikoff's family ranch from Avenging Force. Oh, oh, it's, Sam it's, it's the it's it's the B team's van. <laughs> dun, dun, wah, 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 wah. <laughs> That's the B team song. They don't get the A team song. Meanwhile, they get a, they get a couple notes in house. <laughs> Give Sam Elliott his horse back. Come on now, you you better than that. No, this is Doc Antwerd's house. <laughs> oh. Doc, An- Doc Antle. I'm sorry. Doc I'll say Antle. Doc Antle from uh, Tiger King. Yes, Tiger sir. King. Bhagavan Antle. I will never recover financially from this. Is what the producers <laughs> of this movie said. <laughs> 
The only reason that just the only reason that the whole thing's popular is because of the goddamn pandemic. That's the only reason. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. It it was the perfect time. <laughs> Dude, you know everybody was following that scene. That's like, hey, whatever the shittiest thing in our catalog is, let's put it out now. It'll be huge. Ladies and gentlemen, Troll Two World Tour. Oh my god. <laughs> No, tr- I'm sorry, Trolls 2 World Tour. That's the one with the, the fucking rock, little rock band bullshit animated this, thing. This time, it's personal, partner. Can we get, yeah, troll, we- can we, can we get troll 3, the re trolling <laughs> The re trolling This fucking briefcase phone that he has. Jeez, dude. He got that right from NASA. <laughs> Emerald Tiberius, damn right. Pentangle lives! Ricky. You fucking idiot, it's not NASA. NASA. <laughs> you fucking say it right and do fucking space talk, right? I'm not playing astronaut with you no more. Why do you Don't keep you calling me, bro? Space why, why are you trying to hassle my Hoff? I told you, never call me at this number. Or just take my privates. Does he look like Senator Lipton from The Office? Is he? Yeah. Is he Angela's gay husband? He's having an affair with the green speedo guy. This guy literally bought his hair at the the David Hasselhoff gift shop. Not that there's anything wrong with that. I have a David Hasselhoff action figure. Ooh, from Knight Rider. Oh, nice. I don't have. Kind of jealous of you. Not gonna lie. The car, the car got smashed. Trey never, Trey never wants to play with him. He's always like, he always sets him aside. I'm like, he's like, why don't you want to use the Hoff, man? He goes, I don't like him. I'm like, you've never heard him sing Freedom on top of the Berlin Wall, son. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Tiny ass private jet. That's, that's a half seater. <laughs> you can fit you can fit it. you can fit Willow on there. There you go. <laughs> if you don't pick them up, I swear. <laughs> hey, you two going that way? It's cheats from up and smoke. <laughs> no, no, just some dudes like, ah, oh, damn it, two chicks. I wanted, I wanted a buff dude. <laughs> Holy shit, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. <laughs> it's Bill Cosby's brother. <laughs> hey, get Mar- on in Mar- the back. Marlon Cosby. A- Marlon Cosby. Marlon yeah, this Cosby. Your, bro- your brother, Marlon Cosby. <laughs> Have a put it by. I'm gonna take a picture with Kodak paper. <laughs> Did they get sunglasses from the girls in the uh, the Hard Ticket to Hawaii movie? Yeah, they stole off of them. I was yeah, these are the same one of them wearing the Bret Hart glasses. No, yeah, this is a sequel to last week's movie. Is oh, it is okay. Yeah. So the they're sugar. just hopping on the train that rides around the zoo. The sugar, what is the sugar cane train? Sugar cane train. They're gonna take the train to France from Hawaii. <laughs> <laughs> it looks, it looks, it looks like, like the train to Back to the Future Three. So it's an underwater train? <laughs> it looks like the passengers in the back are going to run the train on them. <laughs> it's an Andy Sedaris joint. Just go with it. The last time I heard, just go that I end up with herpes. <laughs> <laughs> last time someone said, just go with it, was um, the director's casting couch. <laughs> last time somebody, somebody said, go with it, I lost a kidney. <laughs> I woke up in a fucking seedy motel bathtub full of ice. Last time someone said just go with it, it was a goddamn Adam Sandler movie. Oh no! Last time someone said go with it, we, we had the Who pandemic. The takes surfboards <laughs> and gets on a kitty train. And yeah. Nick wins. <laughs> <laughs> I, it's funny because like right after all this thing started, and they were talking about you know the wet the wet markets in you know China and eating a bat and all. My son got this book. It's it's the old lady who swallowed a bat. That's I right. posted Pump it. That <laughs> chest out, buddy. <laughs> Why oh why would the old lady swallow a bat? Why oh why would she do that? So I made a meme out of it with Ozzy Osbourne under it going, this is spitting. <laughs> <laughs> That's good shit. <laughs> I was like, I made, he's, too cool, for, he's made, too cool for sleeves and he's too cool for buttons. He's too cool for school, man. This is how everybody right. dresses in the future. You know what? We we should watch a Death Spa. There's a really really ridiculous movie. Yes, sir. Movie. Yeah, I've seen that one. That's a good one for this channel for sure. Hey, look! The, oh man, oh that, my God! We're now, now we're back in Hawaii. <laughs> what, oh my God! Did, yes, we are. Did they <laughs> did they beat Steve Irwin's family up and take those outfits from Bindi? Oh crikey! 
No, the, the, they borrowed both of them from her, from his daughter. Holy yeah, shit, that, the exact same company. The exact yep. same plane? That Holy shit, it is. <laughs> yeah, it is. Wait a minute. I think this is the exact same scene. I was going to say, are it they is. the same two girls? I did tell you guys this was a sequel to last week's movie, right? Yeah, you but, did. Okay. You did. Yeah, but like, it's one of those things where it's like... I mean, it's in the I description, the too. Same scene. <laughs> He's just reusing footage. He's like, you know what? Ain't nobody got time for that. What does he think he is? Power Rangers? <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, no. Don't my, my kid is hooked on that right now. He's on this kick, so we just got done watching the Beast Morphers. Oh man. The, the, the Power Rangers? Yeah, it came out last year. I'm looking at like I'm oh, watching okay. it going, okay, wait, how old is this girl? Okay, she's hot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm look, looking on IMDb. I'm like, all right, she's 21. We're good. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Some of them we're, Power we're Ranger girls, they've done some stuff, man. What was that one Power Ranger girl was on um, Spartacus? She was getting banged. <laughs> hey, man, she needed, the, she needed the money, all right? She was you don't judge her. <laughs> yeah, I think she was part of that Disney era of Power Rangers. They really needed the money. Oh, no. Jeez. They have a van with no windows. <laughs> if I do care about oh. your dolphin, fine. Oh my movie. god, you didn't tell me this movie was a prequel to Free Willy. It's Snowflake. <laughs> god, I love that movie. Oh, dude, I, I, I haven't watched Ace Ventura in so long. You should. That movie has held up very well. I, I watched love it, it a couple days I, ago yeah, and I, I laughed do. my ass off at it again. Them dolphins will not make you put on sleeves. Oh, Never. Shit, I didn't even notice he had a badass ponytail all pulled over to the side. <laughs> And an Elvis hairdo? Shut the fuck up. This guy's way cool. <laughs> like, this guy's why couldn't I have been... Vaseline. Wait, is this him inside talking on the phone now? Or is this another guy that looks like no, him? That's him. Cool. that's him. Are you trying to say all bad guys that look like Elvis look alike, Pete? I don't it's know. I think, I think so. <laughs> He's got nice triceps, though, so good for him. Bad taste Man, of he hair. Don't, but... He don't skip arm day. He doesn't. Those sideburns. No, but you skip leg day like, like, like Brock Lesnar. <laughs> <laughs> Brock Lesnar's like Daddy. Brock Lesnar's two hundred ninety pounds upper body and ten pound lower body. <laughs> You're not wrong. <laughs> Everybody was eighties driving, looking like Kurt Cameron. <laughs> Kurt Cameron, holy shit! There was a movie I, I saw with him. I'm trying to think what the name of it. it was. Him and Save Dudley Christmas. Moore. No, him and Dudley <laughs> Moore. They switched play. It was it trading you change places? a filthy animal, like father, like son, or something like that. Hmm. Oh my that was god. Like a, Hello. Oh, there we go. Swing. <laughs> All right. Pizza. How old are you, honey? 16. Wilderness 18. Girl. I like where this is going. You can have some sausage. Fuck his collars pop. Those that that she's wet as a fucking waterfall. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she's like, that's a members only coat. Collar pop. Look at that fucking hair. Come with me. Fellas, I am digging this Wonder Woman porn parody. Wait, did, huh? me- did did members only come in denim and uh that came well, well, Yeah, yeah, you, you had to be a member to, to get the denim version. That, that, came, <laughs> with a, a member, that bitch came with an eight track tape. And, if members <laughs> get to bang that fine chick, I'll take it. I'll eight, take that jacket right now. Eight, eight track tape and a switchblade comb. Oh, what was what, what was the yearly membership fee? I'll pay it right now, god damn it. Yeah, I'll pay it. I'll take a loan out if I got to. I mean, he's wearing white pants. After, dude, white pants Alex, after Labor Alex, Day. Alex, been in, Alex been, has been in quarantine too long with the rest of us. He's he's hard up, man. <laughs> I, yeah. Actually, I wish I was in quarantine. I got two jobs. Now Anybody both else been exercising their bowling arm lately? <laughs> Look, man. I, just because shit, I, I switched, I switched to a fifty-pound right bowling ball. Are you kidding me? Yeah. <laughs> Don't shame me because my left arm is stronger than my right arm for some Th- weird That was reason. before quarantine, motherfucker. I'm married with a five-year-old. I can lift a small car with my hand. Oh, my God. And from this light, he kind of looks like Judge Reinhold. No, nah, he looks like David Hasselhoff wannabe. Judge Reinhold and oh. David Hasselhoff. There we go. Kid. Now you know we're heading into the 90s, the shredded jeans. Shit, that could be, that could be like a couple years ago. That's fucking true. Oh, it's going to be a couple of years. It's going to be in a few years now that we're in 90s nostalgia. I was wearing those bitches. Shit. I'd wear those to work with a shirt and tie. My customers come and look at me. You, you want to pet my kitty, Pete? Giggity, giggity. <laughs> giggity, giggity. <laughs> All right. It's a little furry for me, but oh, baby, shit, they ripped in the booty, too. Oh. All right. God damn. <laughs> Cowboys. I don't like where this is going. Club and restaurant. Club. Oh, you will. 
Oh shit! Top back on the Rari, like whoa! I swear, to, I swear to God, if I see some broke back mountain action, you got to remember, gonna... Alex. These are California I mean, cowboys. <laughs> Not there's anything wrong with it, but I'm gonna kill you, Adam. Well, no, no, no. I'm, I'm just saying you'll see it, but it'll be two women. Their idea of a western is a train chain dry wallet. Okay, see what I mean? They Don't can't even get the music my right. Heart, my achy breaky heart. Hey, look at Jeff Foxworthy. They're still dancing oh like God. it's the Apple 1980s. Dude, the, the, this, this, this reminds me of a, of, a, of a club in Tennessee called uh, Cotton Eye Joe's. Wow. It, it's, it's the exact same bullshit. The exact same bullshit. The house oh band God. sounds like ZZ Top cover band. No, oh. it's, just, it's just the Blues Brothers saying, uh, singing that, that one song they know country all, over and over again. When yeah, country Western, yeah. When I was in... Rawhide. Shit, what was it? I was down in... The Hedgehog went to. Yep. It looks like it. <laughs> Where's it's James Martin? Hey, what somebody tell her that. that somebody tell her that bra is not a top. Everybody was white <laughs> Nobody. people dancing. Someone tell that man that's not a dance. Is that the club? Is that the the way they're dancing? It looks like uh, Grand Theft Auto Vice City. Yeah, shit, dude. I'm 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 playing I'm playing part I'm replaying part five for like the sixth time now. I fucking love that game. <laughs> that camisole she's wearing is doing the Lord's work right now. Hold these uh, girls in. You were talking about bars down in uh, in Tennessee, Nick. I was down in Knoxville. I see, I go down there and work in the summer with my old man. And uh, I went to what the hell is it called? The Electric Cowboy or whatever. Oh shit! Yeah, I know where the, I know where the fuck that is. Yep. That's in a shitty part of town. <laughs> yeah, I went there with like my client, like my dad's client, who's like a fucking like multi millionaire. Her, her sister, and like their two nieces. And uh, they it was uh, they helped me pick up women. It was fun. Nice, yeah, yeah. Um, let's see, Knoxville. I'm I'm in Gallenberg right now. I, I'm about okay. an hour and a half. I'm about an hour and a half from there. Yep. All right, all right. Yeah, I uh, we went out to we went out to Gatlinburg and went to like Cades Cove and stuff like that. Oh shit! Yeah, you were up in the mountains then, man. Way mm-hmm. up there. Oh, here comes the uh, the Costco wise guys. He walks in, gonna go crazy about a Costco villain. <laughs> He goes, well, the two of those things on your chest don't look very happy. I like the I way you talk. Pretty. I like your mouth pretty. <laughs> he just says, line. <laughs> line! Line! It's, it, it's, it's, it's not even, it's, it's, it's so 80s that he doesn't even want, a, want an actual line of dialogue. He just wants to do a line right there, and then he'll go back into doing the scene. <laughs> He's like, like line. The, cop, the <sighs> dude in Samurai Cop, which is he's, blow, blow all over his lying. fucking face. Somebody walks up to him with a little mirror with a couple of lines on it. Here you go. Yeah, he's like, uh, 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 line. <sighs> <sighs> line, just put it. Wait, I, wait, don't give me the mirror. Just put it on her tits. <laughs> it's the 80s. Fuck it. Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, sure. how do you think these movies got made? Somebody had to be high. <laughs> Here you go, folks. Now we know what all those do slits her. are for. Do her in the butt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, give it all you got and do it in the butt. What? What? In the butt. <laughs> Maximum grabbage. <laughs> Come on. Are you two 16? Just fuck already. Use <laughs> <laughs> oh, that Patrick Duffy swag you got, son. <laughs> Patrick <laughs> Duffy. <laughs> You That's cannot see does, it now, can does, you? Does, does Patrick Duffy have swag? <laughs> oh, Patrick Duffy was Bobby he, Ewing. He had swag. <laughs> and he got the bang Suzanne Summers on Step by Step. Dude, oh, she was fucking true. hot. She was mm-hmm. hot on that show. She was. There you go. If she oh, had, any, if she, if she had more ass than that, it would be spilling out of there a little more. He's like pulling it tight. That's true. I mean, I'm not complaining, but. Still a better sexy than Velocipaster. Oh Jesus! Don't you even start with that goddamn movie. I love that movie. Oh. I he's, that he's gonna, Alex is going to haunt me with that movie for the rest uh, of my I bought, days. I bought that movie on Blu-ray at uh, at the last horror hound I did. Oh, so. oh my we god! Nick, I'm sorry, dude. We no, I love it. I actually love it. I think, I, I, I think it, yeah, I think it's ridiculous. It, it is. It is. It is. It is beyond ridiculous, and it's so much fun. So we are mm-hmm. literally going to watch that again. God Uncertain damn. Texas. It might be my birthday. Watch Texas. What it's your birthday, is I'll honor Uncertain it. Texas. You, that's like the that's the, that's the that's the sister city of months. Truth or Consequences, New Mexico. Yeah, shit, and and, and look, Big Big Pines Lodge. Just get that Marissa Torme thing going on right now. <laughs> I'm trying yeah, to have still, a couple. Yeah, but of still movies. no titties though. I know. I'm trying to have a couple of movies on schedule just in case because we got a couple of months for my birthday. Any of these could leave. 
But one I definitely want to do is the story of Ricky O. I oh, bet the Chinese it. food here is horrible. <laughs> oh my Alex, god. Alex, you need to watch for Return to Horror High on TV. Camel toe. I need to. That's in the queue. I've not watched it yet. I did put you it will. in the queue. Camel toe. Dude, it's 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 awesome. It's funny as shit. It's it's kind of a parody and George Clooney's in it. It's it's fucking awesome. Actually, I'm off work tomorrow. I'll watch it tomorrow. Yeah, man, definitely definitely watch tomorrow. It's 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 a good fun watch. Don't take it too seriously. Don't pull a black Christmas on me now, man. It, no, no, oh, hey man, I'm not I'm not gonna do I'm not gonna do it to you. Trust me, when you watch it, you'll thank me. It'd be like <laughs> this is a good fun movie. It was ridiculous and it was a good time. Thank you. It's it's yeah, trust me, just yeah, it's it's good shit. It's it's good eighties fun, trust me, it's good shit. I need you are way too clothed for this right now, sweetheart. Are you yes. secretly a feminist? We're talking about all these look other at, movies. Look, 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 look at Mr. I, C- CIA over I here. I hate it when Andy him. Sedaris starts taking the plots of his movie seriously. It's like, come on, dude. <laughs> How dare you take your movie serious? Look at, okay, okay, this guy's trying to fish and he's got an ascot. Who the fuck is this guy? <laughs> I'm saying he's, he's the worst FBI agent, agent of anything. He's right the worst right agent now? of any three letter organization ever because he looks like he, he's standing out, he's standing out like crazy. Even right FBI, now, he's still laughing at him like, you trying to blend in, bro? Seriously? Yeah, man. Like a fucking duck hunter. <laughs> Hi, fellow <Nobody>. kids. <laughs> yeah. I too yeah. am hip. And I fish. Damn, I gotta give you a cavity search. <laughs> Make sure you're not concealing dude, any dude, the, the kid, the kids are pa- passing by the table, going, uh, "Narc." <laughs> <laughs> the guy looks like a character from a Far Cry game. Oh. Shit, he does. You're right. You're right. He does. I think I He's have like one of those ball. somewhere. He's the first boss of a Far Cry. Far game. Cry He's not even four or five. Yeah, oh. just pick one. I think Wilford, I have four. Wilford Brimley is here. Uh oh. With Someone his with his Lawrence. I'm here Welk. to tell you about diabetes. W- Wilford Brimley and he's dressed in a Lawrence Welk outfit. Hang on, kids. Ow. I got this. I'm gonna throw a fly fishing fucking lure in his eye. Gee, thanks for the big tip, you jackass. Oh. Oh shit! Collar. It's about to These go. These are the down. worst, wise guys. Ever. He's got the collar outside the coat too. You know it's fucking go time, bro. I can't help but think Riggs and Murtaugh would have solved this case already. Yeah, they would have. <laughs> yep. from their from, from, from their couches while drinking beer. Is and he Riggs using a, Is that a Mauser? I think it is a Mauser. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Christ. It, it, it wasn't as popular uh, the Entertech Mauser, so they got a good deal on that one. Where did he just put it? He just had it out. Aside. That's what she said. Um, but seriously, is it the boat's called my cousin Vinny? <laughs> <laughs> you know it what? Better not be, God damn it! I'm not even gonna make fun of that. This guy's got a front butt. What the fuck? Did you just <laughs> butt? <laughs> look at him, dude. He looks like he's got a front butt. Oh God! And I'm looking. I don't want to see. Look. I don't want to look. I I looked. He just knocked I mean... fucking. He knocked B. Arthur in the water. I got Thank seven you for days being now. a friend. <laughs> that fucking yeah, pontoon. That, get... that pontoon. This week on Swamp like People. <laughs> this is where it ties into Swamp Thing. Yeah. No, this is where it ties into Live and Let Die. Hey, nope. look, Adrian Barbo's tits. Where? I'm telling you, it's going to be Swamp Thing, and then <laughs> Pentangle is going to show up and fight Swamp Thing. <gasps> oh, my God. The crossover. I never knew I wanted to see. <laughs> see? <laughs> well. <laughs> Avengers, <laughs> Justice League, Mm-mm. Swamp Thing versus Pentangle, greatest Perfection. crossover ever. Giggity, giggity. I, I would <laughs> still match the dragon sound up Jesus against Christ, the, uh, Justice League any day of the week. I love, I, I, I love that ridiculous gun sound. I fucking love it. <laughs> it's like a spaghetti. It's like a che- It's like cheaper than a spaghetti western. Mm-hmm. I make better gun sounds like this when I'm it's playing a, with my GI Joes, dude. It's, I it's, like it's, how she's trying to make driving a boat look sexy. Yeah. It's cheaper than an Italian Western. It's a Mexican Western. <laughs> I'm on a boat. I'm on a boat. <laughs> yeah, I like how they zoom there. in on the shotgun and that. show the chamber so that you don't see the shells coming out as he he's, fires. He's the Tim had made a mistake. He was shooting buckshot. <laughs> hey, hey, Adam, Adam. We don't take kindly the effort around these here parks. You gotta, <laughs> yeah, you, you, gotta you, you, you gotta shoot that deer slug, boy. Yeah, I'm telling mm. you, man. The DNR Boom. doesn't. The DNR does not like that if they catch you fucking hunting squirrels and you're using slugs in your 12 gauge. 
<laughs> we got bay liners in a party barge tied up like a floating trailer park. How come in the 80s no one could ever hit anybody with a gun? Here we go. Let's bring up the old shit. Star Wars, Star Wars a fucking watch flare gun. gun. All right. What kind of flare gun is that? It I have, I, I, clip. I've worked, I worked at a marina for 10 years. I've never seen a flare gun look like that. Maybe you need to make one. Is that I'm not familiar? Familiar? You, that's sweet. It was in last week's movie. Oh, shoot, it was. I do remember Every that. gun in this movie has been in another movie, Andy Sedaris movie. I'm well, not no. bullshitting you. Why buy a new gun when you already got one that cool looking? I'm he just throws saying. them in the river and still recycles them. <laughs> I'm just Look, man, in the 80s, the economy kind of had some rough times, too. Okay, They had to save money. Okay, Bullshit. The profits went up Andy Sedaris' nose. He wasn't going to buy guns shit, and shit. Dude. He's like, look, I just shot 50 rounds and hit and nothing. That, that bitch shot once and killed him. He's too busy spending that money on boobies and tropical drinks. Fuck, yeah, I would. The, oh, shot him right in the front. Boom! I never got to tell you about that. Airsoft, Vader. motherfucker! Uh, Martha. Was, uh, hey, I, I just murdered somebody. All right. <laughs> Martha. <laughs> Y'all laughing, but he was only two days away from retirement. Yeah, <laughs> <that's good>. <laughs> <laughs> his, his goon 401k was all set up. Wait, mm-hmm. lean forward again? No, no. Okay. Oh, okay, sorry. My dogs are barking. I just got done shooting some guy in the chest. <laughs> I'd like to shoot her in the Camel chest. Toe. Oh, that <laughs> Wouldn't we all? Uh, <laughs> I, I mean, not necessarily in the chest, like all over it, maybe, but, you know. Oh, no, trust me. It'll shoot her in the chest. I'll make a mess the in your chest. The velocity will be too much. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be like the, that guy at Planetary. I never miss. There's, Look, man, my competition be... is Patrick Duffy and this weird FBI guy. I think I got a chance. Hey, I'm sending you guys a link in the in the Facebook chat for a movie that's kind of like this. A friend of mine made called it's called Joe Striker. Oh, nice. nice. <clears throat> Let's do it. Joe Pedro. Damn it! I said no Aquaman. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Are you still in uncertain Texas? Ooh, I'm in not. I'm I'm in not sure Iowa. No, I'm in where the fuck Arkansas. <laughs> Uncertain Texas. Wow. Well, first of all, my first question is why the fuck are you in Arkansas? You're gonna get suicided. Somewhere in Miami. <laughs> <laughs> I just keep bitches in my fish tank. I would. <laughs> Babe, I'm gonna take you to see this new band called Dragon Sound. You gonna love it. <laughs> <laughs> you might not be ready for it, but your kids are gonna love it. Oh shit. <laughs> There's this one guy. You got to be careful, though. He might give you AIDS. Thursday. Wait, we're Thursday. keeping track of days. Wait, hold on. All this shit happened on Wednesday? Since when? Was that, was that like a full Wednesday? That is the most that is epic a, Wednesday That is a crazy long Wednesday. I will never complain about my day being Holy long. Holy shit. Day. This whole table looks like a Duran Duran video. <laughs> That's because it's sitting right hot. there. I'm hungry Meanwhile, like, like the a of doom. wolf. Some like it hot. Some like it hot. Oh my god, this uh, this does look like a Smallville version of Legion of Doom. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, look, man, Smallville, they always wear suits and stuff. No one ever had a costume. Meanwhile, you at the Legion of Doom. And the black guy didn't die first. Progressive. Is that, Ron, <laughs> is that, is that Mr. Olympia Ronnie Coleman? Like, before he shaved his mm-hmm. head? That guy's jacked. <laughs> Seriously, Did he just say Salazar? Why is the bad guy always Salazar? Because that sounds like such a bad guy European name. Does, does Salazar work for Pentangle? Yes. I don't know. A name like Salazar, I don't think he's with Pentangle. Who he could be. They are they Salazar. are they need to diversify. They're no, diversifying they their That's portfolio. The whole, point. the whole point of Pentangles, they don't want to diversify. Matter of fact, they would kill that black guy right now. Yep. He'd be yeah, like, he looks uh, like Steve James. Yeah, they would. Oh my god! Oh my god! We're well, gonna take out. Great. We're gonna take out Buff Freddie Mercury and Mister Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's Brock Lesnar. Son. That's, Brock. <laughs> that's that's Brock Lesnar. B- before he did, uh, before he did, only, only, uh, mm-hmm. only not like that. <laughs> I, I thought you was gonna say only fans. I was like, I don't want to see that. <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> Watch Brock Lesnar fist somebody to death. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. OnlyFans is getting kind of weird right now. So I mean, I wouldn't. I would just now, sure. just now getting weird. Just, uh, <laughs> <laughs> no comment. Is she dead? 
Should yeah. I be aroused by this or disturbed? <laughs> <laughs> you have a weird boner right now. <laughs> all, all I'm gonna say I is that, that that post I made on Facebook this morning was about somebody with an OnlyFans account too. So. Oh really? Yes. Look, man, I've been I've been I've been I've been following your, your girl on, on Instagram and whoo. John Cena. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um it's it's funny. Uh I, I I'll we'll have I have uh I have some <laughs> we'll talk about that off air. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> I'm drunk, but I'm not that drunk yet. Okay, I'm all right. My, like no. I had to stop myself. I'm like, wait a second. It. No, stop. Stop. <laughs> oh, Ada, God. There was Ada. final Rocky and Apollo Creed and Rocky 3. Reel it in. Oh, never mind. These 80s boy bands were fucking ridiculous. Damn, Damn Nick, Nick's got me on Instagram you know, now. Bill and Ted really did get into some crazy shit. Well, I mean, it, it was weird because she, like, as soon as I followed her, she followed me back. I was like, this is awkward, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap! It's Angela. Oh, dude, no, no, no. With with you being into horror and stuff like that, dude. No, that's right. If you've looked at her pictures, that's right up her alley. Yeah, because she used to go to like ass? Motor City Nightmare and everything every year. Oh shit! Yeah, they're still acting. They're trying yeah, to. Yeah, sure. They're trying to. Finger quotes. Acting. Yeah, acting. You know, Sidaris. Wait, hold on. Who are you fingering? What's going on? The one to the left. <laughs> there Don't you go. Cheer, um, whichever left you see, pick that one. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, uh, Wonder Woman's name is Pantera. God damn it, it's always Pantera. Motherfucker. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Pantera? Pantangle? Yep. There's a, there's a mystery there. I'm gonna well, that, might be a clue. that might be a clue, ladies and gentlemen. That might be a clue. No. Nah, By the way, uh, if you're watching along, go to www.raiderslostflicks.com and vote on tonight's movie. We will let you score it. We'll read your score at the end of the show. And if we like your score, we'll give you a free code to watch Pete's OnlyFans account. There oh, you go. Jesus, help me, Rhonda. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, if All you right, guys, if, as, if you guys want to watch me play No Mercy. Call. There's no law when the claws involved. Jeez. <laughs> None. Oh God, that is such '80s hair. That's like a weird mullet. That's like a there were, there were, there, yeah. There, there, there are a couple of girls I I follow on on Instagram. Yeah, and they're like, I'm about her hair in a minute. Uh, and then yeah, and then and then they're like, oh, I, I don't post anything nude ever, even even on my OnlyFans. I'm like, why did you get an OnlyFans then? What the fuck are you doing? What's the point of OnlyFans then? You might as well just go back to Instagram. Yeah, it's like what what the fuck are you doing? Just just get a Twitter then. Post that shit for free. It's fine. Oh oh. Told you you'd forget about I'd it. I'd like to see her OnlyFans. Oh, damn. <laughs> <laughs> you still worried that about her cool. hair? What hair? That's what I thought. <laughs> well, look, to be fair, this movie yeah, wants this to way. Between his hairspray and her hairspray, they'll get connected at the head and never be able to be separated. Well, yeah, there better not be any candles in that bitch. If this movie wants me to pay attention to their bodies and not their hair, maybe stop putting clothes on them. Boobies. Nice full ones too. Look like melons. Nice ripe. Summer I don't see melons. the scar either, so at least they're hiding that pretty well. Nope. Go on and get, go on, stick a finger in there. Ain't no one gonna judge you. <laughs> <laughs> Alex is the only one that I know that could be like a play-by-play -play sports announcer for porn. <laughs> Hey, I did play by play announcing before. Friday. Oh, that was a pretty quick Friday. Yeah, I like sorry, how we're keeping track of days now. You do not want to hear pretty quick when he's having sex. But sorry, man, that was quick. Yep. <laughs> they made fun of their own character. Yeah. It's a nice long plane. Ooh. The plane, the plane. Are they back in Hawaii now, or are they in Japan? What's going on over there? It's a Honolulu International Airport. Okay, Reed, there we on. go. <laughs> Ooh. We're back to hard. Okay, fuck? seriously. Right. Well, now she looks like a Batman villain, like the 1960s <laughs> Batman villain. <laughs> well, he looks like Buttons killed his parents in the back alley as a kid, and now he just hates them. <laughs> seriously, did she break out a girl <laughs> prison or what? <laughs> <laughs> shit. I hate buttons. They, I hate them. What a vengeance! They're they're so dependable, and they hold things together. I don't buttons. love them. Buttons are the tools of a coward. We don't use buttons <laughs> around here. 
buttons are the devil. Okay, this is pretty much the same scene. Right no, it is. It is. Shots. Try <laughs> some establishing shots in your movie today. Well, at least it's not. Uh, what was that movie we called with like the ten minute establishing? Day of the shots? Warrior. Day yeah. of the Warrior. That was also an Andy Sedaris movie. I have that on DVD. Was it now. Really? Yeah. That's the first Andy Sedaris movie I saw. Yeah, you saw the worst one first. I'm sorry. Julie Strain was hot. She made it tolerable. Yeah, Julie Strain. Julie Strain's in another one that we're going to try to watch if I can find that one. Julie Strain's hot. Why are they wearing their girls' shorts? He wears their own shorts. I'm telling you. I'm sorry, but no playing of golf in a movie is ever entertaining, ever. Period. Not a, Unless it is I'm if it's played by the White Shadow. Billy Madison. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Unless, yeah, yeah. Unless, yeah, let's play by yeah, Billy Madison. And it's Billy it's called yeah. Gilmore. Then it's yeah, fine. Gilmore. Yep. Oh no! But, uh, if Michael Douglas showed Billy up Man, right I meant now Happy in Gilmore. a Jesus suit and Christ. a gun and started shooting people, it'd be hilarious. Wow, that was so exciting. Hey, you ain't never played Tiger Woods golf. Okay? Oh, dude, the old Tiger Woods games on PlayStation were so much fun. Shit, dude. Here's the weird thing about golf. So much Video game golf is so fun. Real life golf is boring. Pee wee golf with a hot girl. That's about. Oh, you mean? Oh, you mean what? What? what putt putt golf? Like that shit? Yeah, putt putt golf with a hot girl. Dude, dude, only... I love, dude, I love that shit, man. I love dude, that shit. Putt so putt the butt. The only reason dude, I, I ever ever went golfing thought, was to number one get drunk and drive the golf cart. Number two, just get we just get stoned. Dude, Pete, Pete, I, I, I can see you in full crazy golf attire, just getting I can fucking see it. lit. I can fuck. see it. He's got the driving fucking, around, trying oh, to no, dude, you know, trying got, to play golf. I got, I got, I got yelled at because literally, I was wearing what the fuck? I was wearing Timberlands on the golf course. <laughs> like I'm not, I'm not even joking. I was wearing my Tims. I was like, I don't have so golf clothes. Ball. I don't own golf. I, I I've had I, somebody gave me golf clubs. I I've golfed like three times in my entire life, and it's like it was just fun to go drive. Like I went, it was all in one summer. Dude, and there's so much pastel in this shot. I'm uh, like slowly going blind. Yep, just just get drunk and drive the cart. That was it. Yeah, I I, I, I can see with the hat, the pants, the shirt, the whole thing. No, I've got like the little hats and shit, and the like gloves that. and shit, like all that shit, just be just rolling around, just being fucking lit all the time. Like all my friends golf and they like consistently try to get me to. And I'm like, one day I should, I should just like get like a whole outfit and just go out there. Cause I, I, I'm terrible at it. Like I should just go out there and act like, look like I know what I'm doing, but then like just totally suck and just be like, fuck. I'm oh yeah. Just, 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 just get fucked up and be like, you, you fucking, you fucking suck, man. <laughs> I'll break my clubs. And sh- I actually broke one of my, I had a driver, a nice bubble shaft driver. I broke. Oh damn. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yep. It was in a set of clubs I got. I was like, Oh, I need it. Uh, let me borrow your driver. My buddy's like, no, <laughs> no, motherfucker. You just broke yours because your There's slice is here. Junior high talent show is better than this. The yeah, dance number Napoleon and with, Dynamite was better. And, 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 and more tits, you know, so. Yeah. Now go get your fucking shine box. What? You don't want to drink? I roofied. This guy's wearing the, wearing the same turtleneck sweater for days. Now go get your shine box. What's the catch? Well, it's uh, something you'll need a penicillin to cure. Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) I like where this is going. Yeah, I'm sure this is a Vegas show. Nobody wants your half your half sip drink, buddy. <laughs> you've been hold, you've been holding that for up. Oh, there we go. Hello, I got a pearl necklace I give her. He just bet. Uh, can you smoke <laughs> cigarette? Oh, that's a joint. All right, cool. It's a private airplane. No, that's a that's a fucking Virginia Slim right there. Come on now. I was gonna say that thing's like two miles long. Yeah, it's a Virginia Slim. You're right. Yeah, it's a fucking Virginia Slim 100 right there. Come on now. <laughs> Misty She's light, fucking luxury light 120s. Way. Shit, <laughs> this picture will self destruct in five seconds. Right? Uh, uh, that, that's a shame. Oh, they it, killed Bond. You, you spilled some ketchup on the picture, damn it. Why did they shoot Bruce Campbell? <laughs> oh, man, that's Shane Bond. That's Shane Bond. But don't worry, LaShonda Lynch is going to replace him. <laughs> well, now all my concerns are gone. Hello. Calgon, take me away. Hello. I'm moving. 
At first, I didn't think you was going to show me some boobs, but you've been showing me lots of boobs. Told you. I'm going to disappoint you. The scene gets cut off because the homeowners come home and catch these people in their hot tub shooting a movie. All right, cut. (laughs) (laughs) Okay, first of all, you don't know how porn works. They would easily join them after you have it. Funny funny story about that. I'll tell you you after we're done. (laughs) Oh, Lord. Either you let us join in or we're shutting you down. (laughs) Well, get in. All right, we'll have a foursome, whatever. <laughs> so it was already a threesome. I need I an adult right now. <laughs> if I don't have an eightsome, uh, whatever. But the more the merrier. <laughs> yep. Wait, listen to this joke. You have to hear it. But I am Swedish, you fool. Well, Danish Swedish is all the same. God damn. <laughs> There you go. That's how you do it. That's the fucking OG right there. Yeah, man. <laughs> Fuck Real coffee. Pimp. I just need. I just need pussy. Yep. Real pimp and lips here. Everything goes yeah, better you with ain't, pussy. You ain't kidding, man. You ain't kidding. Mm-hmm. Oh god, hey. now he looks like Kirk Cameron. Why does he keep looking like so many different eighty stars? That looks like Kirk Cameron. Kirk, Kirk Cameron. Cameron. I can't wait. In ten years, you're going to be making movies nobody watches on the Christian Network. Yeah. He's going to be hang out. He's going to hang out with a guy named Boner. Boner. <laughs> Rest in peace, Boner. I can't oh, wait. God. I can't wait for saving Christmas. Jeez. <laughs> but your sister will get really. I laughed my ass off watching that one. I did not watch it. Your sister will get ridiculously hot, Kurt. Like, oh, Candace Cameron is so fine. Mm-hmm. God. <sighs> now we need to look her up. Uh, yeah, dude. She, yeah. She, yeah. She's has married to, uh, what is it? Pa- Pavel Bure. He used to play for the Canucks. Mm-hmm. I, believe, I believe that's who it is. Siblings, like Candace Cameron Brew or Bur- so, Beret. Just realize that this guy is actually Q. Whew. Wait, she was oh in fucking um, the Full House. Yep. Yeah, she's DJ. Yeah, that's oh, DJ, man. Did, yeah. Even Kimmy Gibbler's hot as hell now. All those girls grew up to be hot, except ironically enough, the Olsen twins. Yeah, they look like they look like golflings. They look like something yeah, Mark. They, they look like something Brendan Fraser would try to kill. <laughs> God damn! Mm. Some work them glutes. Oh, workout montage. Eighties workout montage. This is, I would say definitely an eighties workout montage. They're showing the glutes. Mm-hmm. And she had That's the shiny, important. the shiny two and a half pound barbells. <laughs> I don't think your form's right. Let me show you. Oh, I've seen how this porno starts. <laughs> These are my favorite kind of workouts. I don't know about you guys. Mm-hmm. This is how ninety percent of the porn that I watch starts, and it ends with a protein shake. Oh yes, it does. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, this really takes me back to when I worked at the gym. Alex, ladies, really, and gentlemen. really, oh, I, I, you know I worked, you missed me. I, I worked oh, at a gym when I was eighteen years old. Yes, and I had keys. Oh I'm shit! Back. Okay, all right. I, I see where you're going with that. I feel oh, sorry God, for the people that use the hot tub at that through. fucking gym. <laughs> Did it at least take him back in time? Some 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 things happened in that gym. There was some floating going on in that fucking Ooh. time. Oh, Jeez. check out my package, ladies and gentlemen. Ooh, Saturday. 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 Wait. Big Saturday. titty motocross. Saturday. Hold up. Saturday. I'm going to say it right now. If this movie ends with Solomon Grundy coming out, it will be the greatest movie ever. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I'm just saying right now. I'm just counting down the days like something's going to happen. Wait, have these girls been wearing them same clothes for like two days now? Yeah, they have. Body Gloves getting some kickbacks off of this one. How dirty and stinky must they be right now? Yeah, I was going to say, we've been wearing these latex suits for days. Really seals in the flavor. By the (laughs) way, I was burning my Body Gloves clothes. (laughs) Oh, fuck. (laughs) I don't know why she sounded like Batman all of a sudden. Yeah, I remember. I remember that skit. I can't. Oh god, I man can't stop so thinking much. about sex. All right, hold on. This, this right here. If I saw this walking in the building, I'd be like, "This is a stripper gram." I just stabbed, right? I just okay. stabbed you in like, the rib. Seriously, like, yeah. Okay, go ahead. Do your number. Tell me this damn you button. Yeah, what, 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 what handyman lo- looks what like that fuck? walking into the goddamn building? Well, if you go to pornhub.com, 
I have a message for you. You want to see what I was in actually, I was actually in, 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 in LA last year and I drove by the Pornhub building. It was weird. I was like, do, do you guys have a job? Can I help with something? Anything? You should I got a camera Brandy phone. I can shoot something. Number. Can I be reception? You should ask Brandy Love's phone number. Dude, I'm pretty sure David Lopan lives in this office. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm lucky if I go with Chinese green eyes. Oh my God, Dan Severin! <laughs> Ken Shamrock's <laughs> gonna bust through the wall and they're gonna start fighting. Oh Look my Mr. God, Dustin, Mr. Gold Dustin, Dustin, Dustin Rhodes <laughs> over here. Rusty, leave his oh. ponytail alone. I must break his balls. Pay more attention One to day. my cool mustache. Leave him alone. One day, his brother will find E A E W. Shit, you're not wrong with that. Mm mm. Oh my god, with that ponytail, he looks like Vega from Street Fighter. Does that have, guy have like something in his claws that says I must never wear an undershirt ever? Like in my Pretty entire much. Life? He hates buttons already hates buttons. Buttons killed his parents, undershirts uh raped his wife. Yeah, he's he's allergic <laughs> to all of the above. Uh, and uh, sleeves uh, kidnapped okay. his children. Uh, okay. oh, all right, he, damn. He ro- he rolls this is this, are the sleeves rolled up too? Is that is that thing going on? I can't really tell. I think it's rolled up. That's a fucking OG sleeves, move right man. there. That's a bold move, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off. <laughs> it doesn't. <laughs> Spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. It did not pay off. Well, <laughs> I know that porno. Yep. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Thank God they're leaving. Wait, is he still wearing the same shirt since Wednesday? Yes, he is. <laughs> yes, he is. He's not exactly a high roller, is he? Uh oh. Black, black man still alive. Progressive. <laughs> <laughs> he, gets, he, gets, he gets to bang the, the, the two white chicks. Look, Andy Sedaris is clearly one of the most progressive filmmakers ever. Ryan Johnson, take note. <laughs> this That's is how you do it. This is, this is, is, is this the prequel to Black Snake Moan? Yeah, no, yeah, it's, it's a, called it's it, it's called both these wetchings are gonna moan. Yep. Mm-hmm. That's right. Turn the TV on. Take it off. Turn on some music. She turns there the TV on. The music so starts. Nobody, nobody can hear you scream real loudly. Ladies and gentlemen, Picasso Trigger. Ooh. Picasso Trigger. This is like the music that YouTube gives you to use on your videos. Yeah. No shit. Yeah. <laughs> what we're allowed to play on our on our dramatic stings. I, do, I, I got some soapy. elevator music the other day. I was like, yes. Get all soapy. Get them soapy. Why are the show- why are, why are the lockers have showers attached to them? This doesn't make sense. Really? <laughs> you're, you're wondering about that doing this scene? Yes. Stop drinking the red claw. Sunday. Sunday. Sunday, Sunday. 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 Monster truck Sunday. The silver dome. Bigfoot. Grave digger. The white claw. <laughs> Hey, look, it's Molokaliki Maka is the, the way to say. <laughs> Hawaii, Hawaii. Yeah. I feel like we're in the wrong movie. Like, we should be in a movie about a giant puppet snake. Have nah, the, 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 the snake. glasses remind me? Have any of you ever seen like any of the Nemesis movies? Like Cy- Nemesis, Cyborg, and all that? Oh, shit. No. Yeah, mm-hmm. a couple of them. Yeah. That that reminds me of like what's her the two bodybuilder chicks Sharon Bruno and Debbie Mugley were like the the killers from the future. They wore those exact same glasses. Oh yeah. Oh my god. I, see <laughs> I would put some Cynthia Rothrock movies on here, but there's never any nudity in them. I ain't gonna lie. For Cynthia Rock Rock, I can live without the nudity. We can forego the nudity. Okay, maybe we'll I, get some. Cynthia I could just Rock watch Rock her beat people up and be perfectly yeah, happy. Yeah, with I'll that. watch China. Was it China O'Brien and stuff yeah. like that? Like. Her and like, rock rock. what's the other one? Mimi Lesios in the eighties. She was like like a hot martial arts chick too. So wait a minute, you tell me there were strong progressive women who could defend themselves back in the eighties? Yeah. Are you telling me Captain Marvel and Ray didn't invent this? Nope. What? Wait. Did what? tell them? No. Hang on. Um, have you ever seen Ballistic? If you've never seen Ballistic, you should probably mm-hmm. watch that one. Oh, for a minute, you know, I thought you was talking about that um, Antonio Banderas, Lucy Liu movie. Oh, Eight Percent Sever, that one. I think I've seen <laughs> that. I probably, I've, because hang on a second. 
the one I'm the, <laughs> the one I'm talking about has Richard Roundtree in it, and uh, it's got um, oh shit, what's the girl's name? I I can't yeah. remember the girl. The, I can't remember the girl's name. Uh, let's see. Hang on. That's another like early '90s. There's a lot of windowless vans in this movie. No, yeah, a lot of shit was happening in, in the '90s, and you know, in Hawaii and Miami, man. That's if you ever mm-hmm. watched the the Cocaine Cowboys documentaries. It's a lot of shooting, a lot of cocaine. No wonder they need a Hawaii Five O. These guys are white belts. I'm pretty sure you can take them. <laughs> you don't know that. They're wearing white belts. <laughs> that's very that's very prejudiced against white belts, man. That's very prejudiced. <laughs> I didn't make the rule. <laughs> oh God! Don't lose. Come on, Dustin Rhodes. <laughs> Here you go, Pete. He just fucking clotheslined. What the fuck is he he's, doing? He's got her in a fucking. He's got her in a fucking cabal clutch or a oh, Boston crab. Okay, I was joking. I didn't think they were really gonna do some wrestling moves. <gasps> Power bomb him. Oh shit. Oh, yeah. no, right in the goods. Right <laughs> in the McNugget. Right, kick me in the junk. <laughs> kick him in the junk. It kicked him in the nuts so hard it killed him. Yeah, that happens sometimes, man. It happens sometimes. It's, it's the it's the you know it's the, the the dice you roll when you kick somebody in the nuts. Back to the trailer park show. <laughs> I just want to point out it's been an hour and seven minutes. Black guy still alive. You can't see me, but I'm fist bumping right now. <laughs> I go lie. I go lie. If the black guy dies, you're gonna have to console me. <laughs> oh shit! He shot her right in the fucking head. No. Holy shit, dude! Jesus Christ! <laughs> she goes back. As a, it, she, she goes back as a cyborg in the next in the next movie. Is, is Turtle not gonna have to choke a bitch? There you go. <laughs> I'm oh shot shit! Of hey, I was in the gym, but I heard I heard white boy just screaming. I, I gotta kill him! I gotta kill <laughs> him right now! Time to wheel up just before the action started. <laughs> oh my God, Billy Jesus Blanks! Christ, that guy's fucking jacked. That's <laughs> yeah, that's Billy like Banks where he shaved his head, dude. Mm-hmm. Put that tybo, <laughs> man. White girl, you you need help because I I I got something that could cure all, all your pain. Yep. Man, I can't believe all these white people have died before me. <laughs> I am magical. <laughs> I think guys become gangsters in the first place. <laughs> these three. And I just want to point out, he's not the lead of this movie. If he was the lead, you'd understand it. Yeah, you're right. He's just a side character. And he survived <laughs> this long. Yeah, yeah, that's he true. he was at his- the gym and and he was at the gym and he heard a ruckus and he had to help. Okay. He let his hair down. Oh, where, did this, where did that guy come from? He I locked thought he the was door. dead. He just locked the door. Where did this guy come from? It's like an old 80s game. They just spawn oh. out of nowhere. Oh, Respawn. Jesus. Respawn. Bro. Bro. Do you even button? Respawning. <laughs> Respawning in five. <laughs> killed my four, family. Three. I have the button that killed your parents. <gasps> Prepare to die. <laughs> oh, he done let the ponytail out now. So yeah, yep. it's serious. Man, that, man this motherfucker let his hair down. down. It's done. Mm-hmm. You got it, guys. We've come a long way with the John Wick movies. We used to have oh, yeah. this, and we thought this was swell. Hey, this is still swell. This is so hilarious. This is like <laughs> the fight scene. In, this is like the fight scenes in Meet the Zohan. Like this mm-hmm. guy's actually. Crying. <laughs> you just got beat up by Liu Kang with a man bun. How do you feel? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like the white version is show enough. The last, the last dish effort of the bad guy. He gets up all bloody hey, and beat hey, and hey. yells before Show he gets enough killed. Would have ended this. Show enough would have ended this in Show twenty minutes and boom, every Oh, sugar glass. Fuck. Wait. Oh, you just pulled a Shawn Michaels. You just pulled a Shawn Michaels, Marty Janetti. <laughs> I was gonna say an Owen Hart. Oh. Right through the cardboard. Fuck. He pulled a Robocop. Here, come, here he comes the Shockmaster. <gasps> oh. Wasn't Dusty Rose the one who created that character? No eyes. Man, I'm making Don't way even more blank. wrestling references in this movie than I thought I would. Well, they were using Boston Crabs and shit. Yeah, I thought I was going to make like one or two wrestling jokes. I made a lot. Uh... I have a black belt and shotgun. Come here, He's baby. like, you got a black belt shotgun. Room. You're gonna have a you're gonna have a creamy white load in your eyes. <laughs> Wait, Bill and Ted, have you been sitting there for the past two or three days? <laughs> They're still wearing. <laughs> they they had no fucking wardrobe changes except for those two in this. Uh, oh, the, listen, the last listen, l- 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 listen, they've been really fucking high, right? They've been waiting for the beat to be able to go off. Okay. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hold up. Hold up. 
what if the reason time seems so weird is because Rufus has been carrying them through these days and just going back oh, and forth? Oh, shit. What if this is oh. non-linear? Oh, shit. We could be watching the beginning of this movie and not know it. Fuck. Say hello to the night lost in the shadows. Inception. <laughs> is the fucking gimmick still spinning on the table? <laughs> Oh, snap. This is the best they road rash cool. movie we're ever going to have. This is like the motor. This is like the dirt bike version of Rad. Couldn't leave well enough alone. <laughs> hey, uh, if Lori Laughlin showed up right now, I wouldn't be angry. Dude, I love Rad. That's still she's to this still day. She's still hot, too. She looks amazing. She's actually, she's still hotter than the girls in Fuller House. I can't wait to see her in Orange is the New Black, too. Wait. She's in that? Well, she's going to prison. I figured they might as well film some. <laughs> oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> That's what you oh, get. No, hold for, up. That's what Shout you get for paying for your Lloyd retarded Laughlin. ass kid to go to college, you rich bitch. Shout out to Lloyd Laughlin, the only good live action black canary that exists. Yeah, pizza strapped oh, to the back sure. of her truck. Her, her motorcycle. She's the only good one. Wait, who played black? Didn't um? See, look, played... she's got pizza on there. Who played her in the fucking TV show in O2? Well, no, no, no. Rachel oh, no. Scarson played yeah, her Rachel daughter. Yeah, Rachel Lori, Lori Laughlin played her mother, who is Dinah Lance. Okay. Yeah, wow. Lori Laughlin played the... Ooh. You dead me, Johnny. Be dead one of alive. us. Dead or alive, you're coming with me. <laughs> dead or alive, I'm coming on your face. Ooh. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, that, <laughs> dirty. This is my kind of party. It's too my joke was made it really dirty. <laughs> a, you're you're welcome, <laughs> damn it. You're welcome. On the back of her motorcycle, they really took this 25 minutes or free shit pretty seriously back in the yeah, days. Yeah, no, 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 shit, no. dude. Gotta remember now. Gotta remember, Bill and Ted. This scene might have only lasted a minute, and they've gone back in time. <laughs> well, they had to shoot this scene <laughs> quick because they only rented these things for an hour. Okay, yeah. first of all, you have a time machine. That hour can last however long you want it to last. <laughs> I think we lost him. I Let's came. I, I think we're alone now. Master detectives here. I came here to shoot dudes and suck dicks, and I don't see any dicks. Okay, they can't all be winners. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna sound. Like <laughs> it's hard to be this funny all the time. Okay. Here we go. Wait, Wait for is it. Is that the boomerang again? Those yep. Not two cartridges. Yes. Damn, oh, shit. <laughs> oh shit! I Woo! missed it. She blew him up. Yep. Damn, Jai Courtney. She's a better Captain Boomerang. <laughs> <laughs> well, Jai Courtney's cutting. Kind of, Jai Courtney's, you know, he's not really good at anything. In all honesty, no. there's um, um, where well, there's a um, but there's that um. Touche, Nick. Touche. <laughs> was, he was. Oh, never mind. He was barely Captain Boomerang. All right. He was in Terminator Guinness, which failed. He was in the fifth uh, Die Hard, which failed. Like he's he's almost yeah, the point of failure in those movies. I'm just saying. So the only thing he was ever good in was Spartacus. <sighs> all right. Now, in order to kill the bad guy, make sure it's the one that's wearing all white after Labor Day. That's Salazar. <laughs> Every day is after Labor Day. Like a Salazar. Especially when you have a time machine. Is that the is that the main character from uh Police Academy 5 assignment Miami Beach? No, actually I think it's Andy Gibb. <laughs> Andy Gibb. Yeah, be dancing. Yeah. <sighs> God, Tina didn't eat her stupid food again. <laughs> Stealthy your pods, ninja. Tina. God, wait a minute. Is oh, this the mind. is this the opening scene to Commando? <gasps> if Arnold yeah. just showed up right now, Arnold just walks up. I just start shooting I everybody. So bad. I Shit, my beeper. That. Where's a phone attached to a wall on a cord? And we need Dolph Lundgren to show up as the Punisher and just kill everybody. Dolph Lundgren, John Bernthal, and Thomas Jane all show up at the same time. Friend. And uh, you know what? I like Ray Stevenson's Punisher. I, I liked it. Yeah, you're barefoot and you're holding a shotgun, buddy. You're not intimidating. With those white shadows. With a pistol shirt. right in his fucking junk. 
<laughs> no, dude, he's no, he's 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 got enough fucking spray tan and 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 baby oil on him to like that shotgun's gonna fucking slip, man. Come well, on. That time there were shells actually coming out of the shotgun. That that guy oh, had no. more fucking baby oil. Oh god, on another, another, another another remote oh, control god. thing. <laughs> Vehicle, ladies and gentlemen, you're getting double the the, the anti sedaris tonight. Seriously, Did he have he, a deal with remote controlled toy companies. He had a deal with Radio Shack. <laughs> he just had a lot of remote control toys and worked That's them into his fucking business. God, you just aged us so much by bringing up Radio Shack, dude. I bought oh. so many. I bought so many like radio control cars from Radio Shack. It was stupid. Oh shit! Ooh. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Don't question it. Just I go, shouldn't just go I with shouldn't, it. I should never miss. Just go with it. <laughs> Should be the only person in the history of a movie to kill somebody with a fucking Uzi. <gasps> oh, she's zipped up. She's taking it seriously. I yeah, don't want the uh, shells hitting my titties. <laughs> <laughs> Can't deflate the airbags, man, in case you gotta go swimming. Those fucking rounds come out of there hot, man. Yeah, they do. This guy is not going to be able to hide from anyone. I'm this Hawaiian sure shirt must be bomb-proof. You can see that Ooh. shirt on the other side of the equator. Okay, no fair. Dude, She's a you camper. can see that shirt from space, man. Come on now. <laughs> he was using like a 1922 fucking side-by-side double-barrel fucking, oh, my God, <laughs> lever action. Oh, Ooh, shit. God damn. Making fun of the guy with the shorts. She's not dead. I Haha, ha, that coconut oil fucking protected my body. <laughs> yep. Fuck you, bitch. Squirt gun? Ooh. That's a little pea shooter for God. men in black. God. Jesus God. Christ. God damn it. You got, got me, you got me in my implant, woman. <laughs> well, you got me in my implant. <laughs> titty fair. for titty, motherfucker. That's right. Tit, tit for tit. Tit for tat. <laughs> tit for tat. In this case, it's tit for tit. <laughs> yeah, that's good shit. He's, He's like, I died holding the man. barrel. It came from the sea, and then they morphed into women. It's the, is she a scroll? Bonsai! Which one? Bonsai! Dun, dun, dun. Okay. I'll, I'll I'm play sorry. you with the my most, octopussy. The most unrealistic thing I've seen is this guy's a complete white outfit, not getting dirty. Yeah, dude, I could wear that for like two minutes, not touch anything or even move, and I would be yeah. dirty. Boom! Oh okay. no! Haha! <laughs> you hit the seat of my bike. Oh crap! How did that? How did that? Just, Just go, go with it. it. Just go with it. Just yeah. Go with it. <laughs> <laughs> it's an Andy Sedaris joint. Just go with I'm it. I'm learning it. Just go with it. I appreciate that it blew up as good as it did. Did that plane ever land? No. Oh, Jr. The cast of the other movies in the. I'm other back from you and oil. I heard Cliff Barnes was trying to take over again. So JR didn't die. He's just mad because our daddy Wait stole it from his daddy. We got Patrick Duffy and JR. Oh my God. This is a Dallas prequel. Dude, yeah. I fucking love Dallas. Don't even get me started. Dallas Trigger will be the next movie. <laughs> Wait, is that a thing? Oh, why is he driving a why is JR Ewing driving a square body blazer? Oh, it's a Jimmy, I'm sorry. I have no idea what next week's movie will be. We'll 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 come up with something. Will it have more hot chicks killing people with mo- mo- uh, remote control cars? We like this shit, don't we? Yeah. And that's what we're going to go for. I mean, I just watched someone get killed with a remote control grappling. Oh, it's great. I, that's I, great. I, it is. It's good. It's good shit. I'm going to ex- I'm gonna explain this to somebody one day and see if they lock me up for it. Wait. Who Tra- trash that? movies are totally better than Hollywood, ladies and gentlemen. They do sometimes try to put in effort in the trashy Hollywood movies. By the way, make sure you go to www.raisethelostflicks.com and vote for your score on this movie. <clears throat> we'll read it after the show. On the air. Side boob. I want, I want whole boob. I want whole boob grasping. That's what if I, want. I can only have part of a boob, I still prefer under boob. Yeah, that's good. I'm not complaining about side boob, but under boob's definitely better. God damn it, it's not on here. That guy has the most lifeless eyes. He may as well be like a living dead doll. <sighs> I'm reading Look, my man. lines. He just found out his brother didn't get shot, okay? Let him have this. His eyeballs look like they're painted into his skull. 
Sorry, baby. The only thing that gets me hard now, now is to murder other men. I what the heck? Is... <laughs> Wrong end, honey. Oh, oh gee, what is it? I'm really concerned. That satellite phone ain't going to work inside, buddy. I'm sorry to tell you that. <laughs> you're in a parking garage, too. Jesus Christ. Yeah, you're in a parking garage. That shit ain't working at all. You ain't getting no signal. Look at him. Now, 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 like now, you, now you look, Bobby. When I get back to you and oil, I'm in charge. Mm -hmm. Now you tell you tell my wife. You tell her I was I, I was I was in Houston for a, a conference. Sure. I wasn't I wasn't I wasn't with Cliff I wasn't with Cliff Barnes' wife down in Albaline. <laughs> Always, always the conference or the late night meeting or some shit like that. <laughs> tell, tell, tell Sue Ellen that it wasn't me. Does that guy have a small wicker basket taped around his leg? I he think is, so. He's the wicker okay. man. Oh, how to get the bees? bees. The bees. Oh, the oh god, that that movie, that movie angered me. I'm like, yeah. what the yeah. fuck yeah. is this? Yeah. Why? Yeah. Why? Yeah. Really? You couldn't appreciate it? Oh, I, no. I appreciate that one. You know what the funny thing is? I don't know how true it is. I heard there was the not the bees. I heard that's not even in the theatrical version. That got put in like DVDs. <laughs> yeah, it's it isn't. And I've seen the original uh, Wicker Man. That's a weird fucking movie, man. Yes, it is. Christopher Lee. Yeah, you could tell Christopher Lee was having a ball in that one, though, man. Holy and shit! And the Equalizer. The original Equalizer. It was Edward something, if I remember correctly. <clears throat> well, I mean, e Equalizer, I, my issue was the last like five, ten minutes of it because then the bad guy became a total wuss and he could and he beat, beat him with basically a nail gun in a hardware store. I'm just like, oh, what the fuck? <laughs> and part two, part two was okay. It was fine for what it is. Two, yeah. Hey, Tony <clears throat> Montana, he's still alive. Look, it basically just became a Home Alone film. See? He didn't die. Did, guy. did he just pull cigarettes out of his fucking crutch? I thought the I told you, happened? Frank, you'll That's never smoke a Marlboro trigger. Light out of my nutsack. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> nice you limp by. Need, need an adult right now. All I need in this world is my borders and my word. Uh-oh. You're going to set my pacemaker off, you dick. <gasps> Say hello oh, to my shit. little friend. Eight six seven five three zero nine, motherfucker. <laughs> I want to play a game. He's real, Jerry. He's real. You don't look very intimidating holding a crutch. Yeah, dude, you're not the fucking CIA. Calm down. Seriously, this guy's face cracks me up every shot to his face. Is that, is is that uh, what's his name from Greece? No, it's, <laughs> it looks like Kinnicky. <laughs> Is that Kinnicky? John John Kennaway or whatever the hell his name is? <laughs> yeah, is that his name? That was like motherfucker looked like Kinnicky with with a fucking dude, with dude, a white dude. He was he was he was also in Taxi. His real name is John oh, Asshole. Yeah. Shit, dude. <clears throat> oh, I see the, well, the, the the sad thing is that him and that Spanish chick from Greece both died of cancer. Oh damn! <gasps> yeah, dude. Oh dang. It looks just like you. In hell? Are you still talking? Just kill him already, bro. Hey, you loaded your gun in front of him and everything. Go ahead. Make my Sunday. Wow. Oh, you blew Wait. it. Wait, Did that's going to keep my rockets on it? Get the <laughs> fuck out of here. Because I'm a rocket man. Oh, that is God. fucking awesome. The security camera had tiny rockets on it. The crutch that had is some one shit. shot and you blowed it. You're yeah. basically the Greedo of this movie. <laughs> <laughs> but unfortunately, he's still alive. McClucky. McClunky. Oh, McClunky. Somebody re edit the scene and just say McClunky. McClunky. I don't know. Let's fuck and let's find out. Yeah. No, your hair has more volume and bounce than mine. Of course, I'm not all right. <laughs> I mean, either let's fuck or let's have a new trees commercial. Whichever comes first. Yeah, we'll fuck. There you go. Pay 
Maybe we should do a sequel to this. No, no, get back. Picasso re trigger. Oh, no! What the? Oh, shit! Oh. <laughs> what a twist. <laughs> Did he fucking. Oh, shit. I was just gonna put a hole in your jeans. God, mm. why you got was... so serious? Help me! What the heck? Just did someone shoot it from off screen, or was it him? It was her. It was Hydra. His girl. Hail, Hail oh. Hydra. Wait, that should have made her blow up. Then I've seen what that spear gun can do. <laughs> well, the budget ran out, Alex. <clears throat> Just what did they spend it on? Oh, the get, oh. change. Yeah, they blew up too many things earlier in the movie. I was just gonna say they spent the getting these girls' breast implants, but you know, no, those were before the movie. I think this is the eighties, man. Those things would have cost. It's a prerequisite to get into an Andy Sedaris movie. Yeah, Probably there's a sign outside Andy Sedaris's office, and it says. Uh, if your boobs don't fit in these cups right here, you're too you're too, you're not ready to be in this movie. And he got sick and tired of fat dudes always showing up. Transition. What did he do? Ch- <laughs> that, that was no point, buddy. You were <laughs> a crutch and you fell down over it. <laughs> Shooting. We don't have enough mo- movie left. And they kept that take. That's the best they take they could take of this. They kept that. They did. That was what they kept. That was what they looked at. Like, let's and release that to the public. They're going for gritty realism here. Wow. At least it wasn't a girl that tripped this time. So it's not a horror yeah. movie. Let's run some more. Oh, a hydrofoil. Man, Jackie Chan could have stopped that. What the heck? He has to get two boat chases in one movie. Hide the face of the stuntman. Well, he is deeply ashamed that he was in this. He's got a helmet on. Ah, the good old 1980s fucking jet skis. I am not going to get killed by Patrick Duffy lookalike. I fucking love those things to death. Step by step sucks. (laughs) Full disclosure, disclosure, step by step was awesome. Wave runners are the bomb. Rave races are better. Okay. Oh, already, shoot the fucker. Why do you got your hands up? We've already seen this guy can't shoot up close. He's bad at it. Just pay George Lucas some money and CGI your head out of it. God, oh my okay. god. Oh my god. He missed to get that close. Oh my god. Yeah, at least be two clips worth of ammo there. Well, he, he must be a stormtrooper or something. Who knows? <laughs> no, no. Stormtroopers can actually hit things when they're two feet away. Just ask Leia and Return of the Jedi. Mm. <laughs> Wait, Lady, well, also, come back. Also, He's Leia in A New Hope because she got stunned, remember? Yep. Oh, yeah. Quick set to stun after she shoots one of them in the chest. They're just like, eh, fuck it. They yeah. step over him. Just not the worst. <laughs> I'm just like, this Jesus, your boy just got shot in front of you. Like, I would have kicked her in the head when she got stunned. He's as good a shot as the 80s Cobra. She shot him with a trident. That Told you. Told and, you. And Brick, I, I'm pretty sure you just stabbed somebody in the chest with a trident. You might want to lay low for a while. Oh, Bye, Aquaman. Seriously, she should be a superhero with that gun. Dun, 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 she is. Dun, dun, I mean, it didn't blow up that one chick that it should have blown up. But, you know... Maybe she set that one to not explode. I don't right. know. She was saving that explosion for this fucking asshole. Because this guy wasn't going to shoot anybody. Right? 
I mean, you're only like two feet away from the guy and you still can't. Twice! Actually, I'm pretty sure three times. Maybe that's why she's turned on by him. He's not going to get her pregnant. She's good. <laughs> He's, He's going to miss that shot. He's been firing blanks through the whole movie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> This guy's face, dude. You know, the black guy would have been a better love interest, which yeah. he is still alive. Progressive. I like how I like how Al's kind of like progressive. That's progressive. progressive. <laughs> That's the new scent from Calvin Klein. Progressive. It is. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, don't you don't you say it smells it smells it smells like college bong water and liberalism. Right. Here's your pen tangled <laughs> right here. He's the iron cross. He's gotta be a pen guy. Oh my god. We're okay, no, up sorry, the sorry, sorry, sorry. It, 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 it smells like bong water and, 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 and pink hair dye. There you go. <laughs> okay, she really should explode. <laughs> <laughs> She's clearly smirking. I can see it. <laughs> He lifts her arm up once, drops, twice, drops, third time, starts shaking. She's pumping her fist. Oh, she's not dead yet. She hulks out on him. <laughs> oh. oh, Jesus. He shot Father Dowling right in the chest. Oh, no. So much for your mysteries, Father. Take that to God. <laughs> oh, Admiral Tiberius sent me a present. Thank you, sir. Is it more Catherine Bell pictures? Is he is is he trying to use his fucking cane as a sniper rifle right now? What the hell's going on here? It looks like you it. Know, he's got he's got a calculating computer for like distance and wind variation and shit. Yeah, like, yeah. And typing these coordinates and the wind science. speed. Hey, this guy's gonna hey, shoot him with a twenty five hey, auto. He's gonna science the shit out of it. Yeah, he's like he's like, I'm typing this shit in the fucking computer. So give me a goddamn answer. Play it, Adam. How it's future it, shit. How, future how shit. How future future I'm shit. I don't have that clip uploaded. Okay, it's clearly just a calculator. I can he's, even see the C. He spelled boobs, all right? He spelled fucking yeah. boobs. <laughs> he did. I can see the clear. I can spell a, boobs on a calculator. Uh oh. That said Texas. Oh, shit. In, just stand there, dude. That said Texas Instruments on it. <laughs> yes! He finally <laughs> shot it. He, he used a goddamn TI 83 and shit. TI 83. I was Texas supposed to use this for long division. <laughs> Cosine and sine. <laughs> and my teacher said I was never going to use a calculator in real life. <laughs> hey, look. I like how they always end these movies like a Magnum PI episode. Oh, they do. I fucking love it. <laughs> so hey, everybody's ever, ever in the beach why. drinking and shit. We just it's killed like 7,500 people, but you know, fuck it. Let's have a glass of wine. Fun. We're mass murderers now. But damn it, don't my hair look silky smooth? Let your soul you, let your soul glow. Dirty <laughs> Let your soul glow. I use head and shoulders. That and a little bit of Aquanet. Wait, Professor, you have a phone call. I'll get you next time, Gadget. No, no, it's mean, nice, nice job, Angels. Tommy was so if he had a baby with Fabio. <laughs> <laughs> You're tearing me apart, Fabio. <laughs> That's what oh she God. said. <laughs> I kind of want Tommy was to, to, to do a crazy like adult swim cartoon almost, you know, or like even a South Park episode. Oh, I, think, I, think, I think I think I think it would be amazing. Yes. Did you want to bet the rap party is literally the last scene in the movie? Wait, was that? <laughs> wow, that was quick. <laughs> No Steve fade, Bond. No, yeah, no, no fade into the credits. It's like bam, card, credits done. They just, they just film it, you know. Oh come on, don't do that. Show don't the, do that. Wait, quick, show oh, the scene of him in the fucking thong again. Show that. Hey, look, Patty Cakes was Pat Dufick. At least show me some boobs if you're gonna show me Pat scenes. There you go. Juan, Juan was John. Juan was <laughs> John Brown. Well, I'll boobs. be John Brown. We had six stunt people for this whole movie. <laughs> Playing that 80s also music. Appearing. Also oh, appearing. God. Oh, God. Stop. Stop. The honky tonk. Stop. The honkies of honky tonk. The honky tonk, but donkey donk. You're trapped. She does not think Costas you're trapped. This is on by Fiona. They couldn't even spell her name right. It was Fiona. 
Picasso trigger painting by Jimmy Hatter. <laughs> the point is, <laughs> like, like tape them on the back of like forklifts and shit. I miss that. Uh, They're getting lazy. Greatest MVP of the movie. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. He's, 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 he's not credit. Wait, of, like, wait. Go, go back. It said crutch gun designer. <laughs> Really, it was a fucking guy. Wait, that hold on, hold on, hold on. Was, 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 was that guy credited as Buff Black Dude as, at some point? <laughs> I I have looked it up. I've looked this was filmed in Shreveport, Louisiana. <laughs> wow, wow, they couldn't even afford Honolulu this time. VIP boats. <sighs> Quick, don't shoot my wet jet. <sighs> Who How many locations did they use for this? Jesus, they probably use a lot of a lot of B roll and like in between cuts and shit. Hey, look, here's Thomas the Train. Hey, uh, Pete, Snowflake the Dolphin. That question is they used the entire theme park. Dollar rent a car. Thank you. <laughs> Cow- Wait, Cowboys is a real place. Yeah. Wow. And Andy Sedaris film, The End. We put that up on a typewriter, ladies and gentlemen. Yep. VIP boats. <laughs> I'm going to take the time to type that out on colored construction paper. At least they didn't it? have the uh, the boat fucking rental place on the side of the right. boat. Oh, like, shit, like, that's true. Like, that's true. Was that um, Samurai Cop? I think so. Oh, yeah. That was Samurai Cop, yep. The producers wish to thank no one who wants credit for it. You gotta admit, though, these movies are never boring. No, hundred percent, hundred percent. Not when you got this guy who hates buttons. The the worst thing is is when you're watching with these and they're just boring as fuck. Pretty much th- that pretty much sums up the entire uh, vampire lesbian vampire thing that we did. That was a terrible idea. Never. See, I know, I know lesbian vampires. That's the come. I'm the only one who picked a good movie. You're the only one that picked the right one. Yeah, I'm the one. If you ever do that, get all, pick all of them. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! I found <laughs> one. Don't make me try to go for two. <laughs> you know what, buddy? You're scoring this fucker first. Hey, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna give it. I'm gonna give it a three. I enjoyed it. It was fun. I think I I like the last movie more, but this one was more over the top. But I still give it a three. I did like it. It's, I got tits and hey, the black guy survived. Progressive. <laughs> Next. <laughs> Nick. Oh shit! I'm on camera. Uh, um, I, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna give it a. Th- I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it. I don't know. I want to give it a three point five or four. <laughs> <laughs> so not my only fans. You gotta pay for that shit, right? That's the description <laughs> service and be a link in the bio. <laughs> calm, yourself. calm yourself. Calm yourself. All right, calm yourself. Um, I don't know, man. I kind of, I don't know. I, I'm going to, I'm going to give it a four. I'm going to give it a four. It's not as good as last week. Not as many tits. Um, but it's still, it's still a fun movie. Andy, Andy Sedaris doesn't make a good movie. He does make a good, a good entertaining movie for sure. A lot of explosions, a lot of crazy shit going on. Definitely needed more tits though. Definitely needed more tits. I agree, and that's why I'm going to go next. I, I was thinking about it through the whole movie. I, I'm definitely going three on this one, just because it, it is as as fun as these movies are. Last week was way better because we had a giant snake. We had the credits on the forklift, which I said was kind of magical. At least I enjoyed that, and uh, yeah, more boobs because like the last one. I, I don't think we were even ten minutes in the movie. Directly to the action. It's like yes, know your target audience. Don't waste our time. And of course, uh, Pete's always got the best uh, reviews here, so that's why I saved my brother from another brother for last. That's well, he's drunk. I, yeah, that is true. That is true. <laughs> I am, uh, I am inebriated. This was an interesting movie. We got to see Pat. We got to see like a Dallas spinoff with you know. I mean, I don't know. J.R. Ewing and Bobby were really disappointing in this. I didn't get to see Jacques or you know Cliff <laughs> Barnes or Sue Ellen or. You know, it was it was kind of disappointing, but they seem to keep Ewing oil in check. So I'm going to go four out of five on this one. Could have been more tits, but, you know, the tits we saw were quality. Uh, no Aquanet cans were killed or harmed during the making of this movie. And no actors had blow on their face. So I'll go four out of five. It was a good 80s movie. I'm here, sure, man. All right. So uh, what we're going to do next is uh, I'm going to put a link to the website since I know everybody's way too lazy to uh, – Go and look at it yourself. So I'm going to help you out. 
go here. Oh, calling lazy, good sir. Well, not you guys, but you know the, the rest of us. It's Friday night, after all. I mean, you know, hey. everybody's too inebriated to remember. So if you go to this link right there and vote for the score, we're going to do the audience score last. See if you guys agree with us. I think. Um, let's see. Nick was a three. I was a three. Alex was a three. And or no, Nick was a four. You were a four, right? Yeah, it was a four. It was four. So two threes and two fours. So that's. Uh, I don't even know where that average is out to. So I think we need a tiebreaker. So and that average is some number I can't even comprehend. I need a little calculator attached to a crutch to figure that fucking number out. <laughs> I need. <laughs> I need the the wind speed, the variation, and the distance. What's going on right now? What's, what's the traject? What's the trajectory? Yeah, was some words words are hard. Words are hard. I need I need I need the spin of the earth, the Coriolis <laughs> effect. What is what is that number? What is that what is that thing? Which parallel are we on again? <laughs> Forty six. Where's parallel. my TA eighty three? God damn it! Where is it? <laughs> I need I, I need the graphic gal calculator. Like Casio watch. Beep beep beep. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! All right, let's see what we got here. Is anybody voting? There we go. So we got a little bit of a mixed bag. We got one five out of five. Ooh. Two four out of five. So I think that let's see, what's that average up to, guys? Is that a four out of five across the board then? Mm-hmm. All right. So mm-hmm. four four out of five is this the official score of Picasso Trigger, the direct sequel to Hard Ticket to Hawaii. I still like Hard Ticket to Hawaii better. But um we are thank you for voting. We're glad you like these kind of movies because we want to show more of them for sure. Hey man, these are these are hard times. We need we need we need these movies right now. We need fun, ridiculous, crazy eighties titties and and remote control exploding things and all kinds we need that shit right now we need that shit right now Kelly chow you're the man and that's why i promoted you uh friday nights are all right for watching some entertainment movies that don't really suck and yeah that that i agree uh we like to think outside of hollywood we like to bring you the trash and revel we're we're bringing back the skinamax days you know what we're saying so see with me there are people right now watching discovery family (laughs) With, with movies, with movies like this, this gives me hope that someday I, I could honestly like. I think I could I could write a better movie than this probably like over the course of the weekend in like a drunken like Hunter S. Thompson state. Like I mean, give me some mescaline, I could come up with a better script. Like, oh shit, this that's called morning. that's called that that's called a thing. I think it's called the the, vom- the vomit script where you get it all out at once. It's called the vomit the vomit. Uh, and, and it would still be better. Still this be better like than the Last Jedi. Show, man. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? We've almost got enough talent between the four of us that we could almost put one of these types of movies together. We need, we need. Listen, to man, bread, li- you're bread. not, you're not, you're not kidding, man. I'm just saying, you know, you come up with the script. I know a lot of people in Atlanta who, who, who make all this kind of shit. Like the movie uh, Joe Striker was done by a good friend of mine named Ryan Cadaver, who's also the lead singer for Casket Creatures. If you haven't heard Ooh. that band, they're on Spotify. They're a they're 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 a nerdy horror band. Like they they did a movie about uh, Tucker and Dale. I'm sorry, they did a song about Tucker oh, and I Dale. That movie. Nice. I have I, I own that, that DVD. Movie. Yeah, they, they they do they did one. They do another song called Springwood Slasher about Freddy Krueger, and it's like they they do a lot of fun shit. Uh, I love those guys. Go listen to them on Spotify. You will not regret it. They they do a lot. Like I think their newest album, which is like five or six songs, it's like a really you know a small LP. They did um what the hell was it? Um Amityville Horror. They did a song to that. Like they do a lot of fun shit. Uh go check them out. They're definitely worth it. I want to thank everybody in the chat, Admiral Tiberius, Tony Tone Deaf, and Keely Chow for showing up. If you guys are catching this later on the upload, make sure you hit the thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. We got a lot of uh of action this week as far as subscriptions go. So I'm just a few shy of five hundred. And once we hit that, we're gonna be watching the room. Very, very inebriated. Viewing. Yeah, you, you, you know, you guys want us to get really fucking lit and watch the room. I'm just saying. I got I'm a bottle of whiskey in here for the room. All, Ooh, I'm shit. I'm yeah, I'm just, this. I'm just saying, man. You know, you want us to watch the room, and I mean, we, we, we might live tweet. We, all of us might live tweet and start, you know, tagging fucking. Um, we're gonna get stupid. Tommy, what's yeah, up? yeah. Well, well, why is that one? And just to see what happens. Maybe he'll maybe, maybe he'll get on. Maybe he won't. Maybe we're, he'll get irritated. We're gonna, gonna get, we're gonna get knows? stupid. Not not swap. Who are we kidding? Who are we like kidding? Now. We did great. Did not stuff. hit her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not hit her. I did not. Oh hi, Mark. You know, if we water. treat him enough, we can get Greg Cesaro to be in this. Oh Greg yeah, 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 all, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just, just throw, stuff. throw, throw Greg, Greg a link. Be like, here, here's a link, man. Get on. <laughs> I heard he's a really cool guy. So. He I is. Mean, yeah. 
Yeah, I, I met him at a horror convention. He is super, super nice, and he will give you the time of day. He was talking to all the fans and about everything. He was answering the same questions over and over again. He didn't care. He was just kind of like, all right, whatever. <laughs> you know. I'm not going to lie, man. I don't want to be in a room alone with Tommy Wise, so guy fucking creep. <laughs> I do because I want to pick his fucking brain. Like, seriously, I dude. Like, really I know. really want to, like, mm-hmm. I want to know down this there, motherfucker's bro. backstory. Like, I'm... Yeah, like I it's, know what his acting process is. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> what, what methods do you go through to prepare Wait, for a role what? and fuck some poor girl's belly button? Did but you say that, acting process? If I, I know what his acting process is, I can avoid it. You see? <laughs> Son of a bitch. I'm afraid. At, at what point? Were, at what know, point were you like shooting a sex scene? Going, I'm just gonna aim for mid fucking like mid chest and just yeah. show my ass and call it good. Like <laughs> when you said you did not hit her, you did not. Did you really feel that second not? Did you really feel it, Tommy? Deep no, in your diaphragm. You Thanks, Alex. You think he felt anything? <laughs> he, he, no. he felt it. He felt it deep in his balls. <laughs> and also, I would ask him the most important question I can: How old is Denny? <laughs> Yeah. What, what? 43. 43. <laughs> what, what at what point do you just like, hey, the little neighbor boy that, that I'm, you know, helping put through college and everything, I'm, you know, helping Is take care college? of. Him. He just like so jumps, jumps into like so my dope. jumps into my bed with me and my old lady and is like, hey, can I watch? <laughs> it's like, oh, you goofball, oh, you little rap scallion. They you know, like, like, hey, he's trying to lay the like, lumber to this bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, man, they could was recording for his own OnlyFans, okay? All right. He was he was getting that oh. shit so, so, so he could make some money on the side, all right? College is expensive, goddammit. <laughs> and so, and so, are, so, are, so are drugs. Drugs are expensive. He needed that fucking money, okay? I was young and needed the money. <laughs> Oh man! Is that always the excuse? I mean, come yes. on, now. come on! You have more times than I care to remember. <laughs> did you ever see that music video? Someone did a spot. Uh, what is it? a songified for the room? Oh, dude, I've seen, I've seen, I've, I've seen. What is it? I've, I've heard the, the, what is it? You are my rose, like the techno version, or the, the, the or the, the fucking crazy techno version of that. And I'm just like, this is amazing. I want to get so to high listening to this. <laughs> one was like, what is it? I did not hit her. Oh, hi, Mark. Yep. Yep. That's fire. Dude, somebody somebody sent me that. I that's hilarious. I sent you that before, did you send yeah. me that one? Okay. Um, Healy Chow, I, one. I, I hope we can go to Waffle House. I would love to go to Waffle House with these these Yahoos here. Uh if we can't shit, man. Don't no nah, don't right. don't tell me Waffle House, man. I'm like All right. I will tear up some Waffle House right now. Let how me about tell this? you. Fucking if, delicious. If we still if can't we, go to Waffle House, how about we eat waffles while we're fucked up and watching the show? Would that work? I'm okay with that. I think I, I can make that. that happen. Yeah. I'll okay. be text. I'll be texting just my wife. Here and and my wife gets up like, "Hey, bitch, bring me waffles." Just have waffles. <laughs> I gotta have some chicken in there too. But I think oh, at some point we, have to, we have to do some kind of a waffle I'm house black. meetup. I can say that. No, K- KFC has like chicken and waffles now. I think don't they? They do. Because I have a I, have- a. I don't have a waffle house within like. 300 miles of me like i would literally have to drive to ohio to toledo to go to waffle house there's no waffle houses in michigan i fucking checked um but there is like i could go to kfc and get chicken and waffles there which we I have mean, a waffle house but 40 minutes away but it got closed down because they were roaches so oh god well it, i hop i hop has chicken and waffles they have their chicken and waffle yes. plate they have so you know they're in an IHOP within fucking three hours of me. <laughs> oh Jesus, dude! I'm not joking. I I, I seriously like. I, I Where live, are you living, man? The fucking bum fuck Egypt, Michigan. <laughs> <laughs> He's in the witness protection program, Alex. Apparently you got so. Him way the fuck out there, out. In no, the no, you got it wrong. It's the witless protection program. Oh, oh, oh shit. Are you hiding from Ruby Rose or Brie Larson? Brie Larson. <laughs> I turned forty and she's pissed. Oh, he was, he's been telling me what to do for two fucking years. She doesn't years. need you to it's tell her what to do, time. Pete. <laughs> she's a 40 year old white. Know. Yes, and th- like I said, uh, uh, contrary to the troll's belief, I am white. I'm, I mean, I may come off olive sometimes, but that just depends on what lighting I have on. Ooh. Yeah, he, 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 he may put on a very convincing Mexican accent, but he ain't Mexican. <laughs> no, no. I'm Our Lady, mm. the Courageous Caucasians. You know, when I first met you, I thought you were Mexican. No lie. <laughs> Seriously, dude. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah because he has that fucking was, low hat going right, on. Right, there's yeah, a I picture know. of him, and he had, like, this really mean look on his face. And all I saw was the bald and, like, a little bit of a goatee. I'm like, oh, yeah, he's probably... When I grow, like, when I grow my I fucking, like, my white. Head, yeah. I thought you were just straight white. I, yeah, I, I am. I, I, thought, I, am. I, thought, I, thought, I thought he was black. Hispanic. Yeah, I did. I thought I, Nick was black, though. Yeah. 
I'm 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 black like the night, motherfucker. Well, you know, <laughs> Jeff always introduce always introduces you as a last standing Samoan, so I thought you really were Samoan, dude. No, like, no, dude. He, I'm, he had I'm, me I'm, fucking I'm... going with that shit for a long time. I'm like, oh, he's wait, are you not Samoan? Samo- I, I thought no, 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 no. Okay, okay, to 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 break the to just break the mold, whatever. I'm Indian. That's what it is. Yeah, I'm breaking kayfabe. I'm I'm Indian, so. Things that you know, right? Yeah. The more you know. <laughs> I'll fix your computer really well. I'm just saying. You know. I didn't even figure that out till you started being on my show. I'm like, oh, he's not Samoan. Shit. <laughs> Next thing, no, I'm IT, motherfucker. I just got used Pretty to much. it. <laughs> Learn Pretty something much. new every day. Yeah, man. Bitch, you for real? <laughs> yeah, ever since I've been in Tennessee, I've been, fil- I've been fixing my family's shit all like for the last like two or three, two or three months now. <laughs> Oh yeah, I'm, I'm I'm the family IT guy too. Join the fucking club, dude. I, oh, dude. Not Christmas, kind of Christmas, Christmas, Christmas morning is the worst fucking day of my life. <laughs> so you have to like get everybody shit set up, right? All their, new, all their yes. new, all their like, new, all their new Yes, the iPads, the iWatches, the iPhones, the fucking oh. MacBooks, everything. They're like, guys, how do I do this? Enter your email and password, and you'll how be many fine. Fucking gadgets <laughs> have set up this week. Oh fuck. Jesus, this man. Mornings are rough. Yeah, I hear you, dude. I this is why. God, this is this is why I love the Raspberry Pi because I can make my own shit. So I just I just do that the whole time. Like I, I literally made my own Dropbox the other day, and I have one. What is it? The Raspberry Pi Zero running a DNS uh, blocker. So like I have no ads on anything I fucking have. Even my Roku, no ads, nothing. It's like fucking wonderful. I uh, I consider myself pretty tech savvy, but yet I still can't operate Twitter. So who the fuck knows? Oh, geez, I finally man. figured out. I'm finally figured out Twitter. So like. That's like I, I've got I've since I'm learning it. I, I I've got that. I, I understand like the hashtags and like being in that other gimmick I'm doing now, I kinda have to, so it's like, all right. Cause they I'm like all day now I'm on Twitter. I'm like, God damn it. I'm like another note. All right, I'll do guys, it. I'll do it. I have an announcement this week for my channel. I'm gonna have an extra live show on Wednesday. We're actually gonna be reviewing a Nicolas Cage movie. Um, give me one second. I'll tell you the name of it because I know it's one that I haven't seen before. Yeah, I mean, I, I run, I run the World Class Bullshitters Twitter. I, I run the World Class Bullshitters social media accounts, like the Facebook, the Instagram, all the Twitter. That's yeah. all me. That's all me. Cool. So anything that's posted on there is usually me. Every now and again, Jeff will post the links, things like that, because it's automatic. So, but usually it's me because I have to go through and like. <laughs> If, if 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 we get twenty notifications, I have to go through and figure out why we have twenty notifications all of a sudden, and then like mute the conversations on certain things because we get people who like really like mass um that'll mass um tag us in a bunch of stuff, so we have to kind of like you know mute the tags and stuff. So it's okay. fun shit. The world, the movie that we're going to be reviewing is Between Worlds. So Loitering in Wonderland has a Nick Cage cast, and we're going to be review uh, doing a live review of a Nick Cage movie on this channel Wednesday. I don't remember. I think it's going to be 10, 10 PM. It's going to be the same time as my Tuesday show. And then of course the Tuesday show we're reviewing episodes of uh, tales from the crypt and uh, twilight zone. So we're starting to pick up a little steam on that last week. I apologize. We started really late cause we had some major fucking problems. Uh, Phoenix's computer wouldn't work. And then we couldn't get Frank's audio to work. And we spent like about 45 minutes dicking around trying to get that to work before we could even broadcast. So, it was unfortunate <laughs> that shit happens. I apologize. We'll try not to do it again. But hey, man, you know things. This is this is this is the real... downloads. I understand. I totally get it. But I do man. apologize. Dude, this my is, live stream is... got struck down last Tuesday during the yeah, stream. Man. Yeah, yeah, man. YouTube's you, you, YouTube's getting weird now that Joe Rogan fucking went to Spotify. So they're getting <laughs> they're getting they're getting a little crazy. You know. So these things happen, man. It's 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 it's, it's shitty. Yeah, I agree, but you know they're gonna. I mean, if 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 Joe Rogan is taking his 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 entire you know um, following to Spotify, I mean that's a that's a that's a telling sign of the end. I think. Wait, so, so. you're saying there's a spot for a bald guy who's a stoner and a part time conspiracy theorist with a podcast? Yes, Jamie, well, I, Jamie, I need, Jamie, I need to see that on a playback. <laughs> Jamie, put, put that on a playback, Jamie. I I, I, I got to see this. I got to see this. So, so basically, what's what's going on here is, do, am I doing the bug guys good enough? There is is that? Do I what do I what do I need to do here? It looks like you're about to put some tinfoil on your head. Keep going. <laughs> <laughs> I got to go to the kitchen get some tinfoil. Hang on, Jamie. Jamie, play the tin clip. Foil. I'll tin be right back. Tinfoil now. Tin foil now. <laughs> <laughs> So speaking of Pete, what do you what do you got going on that you'd like to tell us about? What 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 shows you got down the pipes? 
Well, in the pipe, as soon as I walk out to the mailbox, some Mary Jane. But uh, but, but more importantly than all that is tomorrow, 2 p.m., Etapo Queen's a place to be reviews. You will be getting episode number three, Trace, for our Spanish speaking viewers at home. Episode of Is It Woke? That's right. And you're just going to have to wait till tomorrow to find out what I am dissecting to find out if it's woke. And I guarantee you this week it will be done in five minutes or less. Monday night going in raw, episode 103. Tuesday, the super happy, terrific, fun time pro wrestling podcast. We will be doing a watch party on Tuesday night for the Hulk Hogan classic movie. No holds barred with myself, Mad Dog Warren, and brother Will Vendetta. Wednesday Ooh. night, I'll be over on the Phantom Collective for Nerd Blast. And uh, Friday night, I'll be right back here next week for Raiders of the Lost Flicks Live. And you'll be getting single release videos probably three or four next week. So that's what I got going on. I love it. Between all of us, we got a lot of stuff to entertain you guys with. And that's all we think about pretty much 24-7 is how to entertain you guys. And we, we do enjoy the shit out of it. Don't get me wrong. I, I, yeah, I, man. Um, you know, make sure, so, you know, so, the uh, yeah the people watching in, you know, in the live stream right now on YouTube, make sure you share the stuff, man. We're watching, we're watching good movies. Adam always provides a link so, you know, you can watch along with us and have a good time. And, you know, we're always picking really fun stuff to watch because uh, things are fucking depressing right now. We need some fun yeah. shit. We need some real, real fun, crazy shit to watch these days. And you know, by I've all been, means, if, if, if you guys need to, you know, I've been inebriate here. yourself in, in a certain way or the other, um, go ahead and do that. And you know, have have a good goddamn time. I've been introducing you to some new trashy movies, and you've been introducing me to a lot of technical things that I didn't know about before. Listen, man, and I never knew any any Sedaris was was a dude, and I bought three of his movies on Blu-ray, so I'm fucking happy. All right, I'm <laughs> and, and Miami Connection. I, Miami I Connection, dude. I can't dude. sell Miami. If I could go door to door and sell Miami Connection to people, I would do it for free. You are the Jehovah. You're like I the have, Jehovah's Witness of Miami I, I, Connection. I, 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 Hi, have you heard the good book of Alamo Draft House Miami Connection? Because if oh, you haven't, shit, <laughs> I'd pass out with cards. I'd be like, "Hey, have you heard of Miami Connection today?" You know, somebody slams the door on Alex. He shuffle or on Adam. He shuffling his feet. Come on, sister, let's go. Come on, yeah, come on. <laughs> like the ladies and Friday. Pass out little cards on the corner and shit. You know. Oh my have god. You heard the- have you heard the good word of dragon sound? Can I oh, come shit. in for a minute? <laughs> what you what, what you need to do is make your own like driving in your in, in your oh, house, whatever, oh. and get to get a projector and like a fucking FM transmitter and be like, yo, tonight at my place on the on, on, on the big on the on the big white sheet in my in, in, in my front yard, Miami connection. <laughs> It's happening. I Do agree. It. We got We got to help Pete out, man. Keely okay. Chow. Keely Chow. Chow. I, I, I am. I am no. I know. Me and strip clubs do not get along. Number one, mm, strippers for some reason have an affinity for me. I don't know why, but they do. It's. It, it's seriously. Maybe they and, think you got money. It's well, all kind of games till they want to bounce one of their three kids on your knee, and then yeah. Like- <laughs> no, seriously, this is this is not funny. When I was what, when I was like nineteen or twenty, I hooked up with this stripper. She was like eighteen, and I went home with her. And I get I get to I get home. Number one, strike one was she took me back to a trailer. Strike two, I walk in. There's there's toys everywhere. I'm like, what bitch? Uh, see yeah. what bitch? And, and strike three was the next morning when her babysitter and her brought her her sister, who was her babysitter, brought her kid home. I'm like. <gasps> Peace, bitch. I'm out. Yep. I'm like, oh. And that really made things awkward when I started nailing another stripper at the same club. So I need to join a convent. (laughs) Goodbye. I'll never be back ever again. How to be be 18 again or 20 or whatever. (laughs) That was a long fucking time ago. Dude, dude, there are are a lot of strip clubs in in, in Atlanta. Let me just tell you. There's a lot of fucking strip clubs there. I, I, I avoid those places like the plague. A friend of mine had his 40 year old birthday there. I think was it the end of last year. <laughs> I, I have not been to a strip club in on, honest to God. I have not been to one in like 13 years. I just, I, yeah, I don't, same, man. I, I got, I got burned. Like that. I went through that phase when I was in my late, like 18 through like about 22. And I'm just like, Nope, I'm good. I mean, now, I, 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 video I stores, that's different. Yeah. Oh yeah, 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 definitely. But I mean, I I, I understand that, like you know, I, I probably go once every like three years. Yeah, and that's and that's really that's like really like you know, yeah, really really stretching it. Maybe three to five years, depending, you know. But yeah, I don't I don't frequent that place, and I have a, I have like a, a certain amount of money I only spend, and then I'm out. Yep. I don't I don't go past that shit. No, no. <laughs> I, I was never walking up in there with racks and going, hey, guess what? No, it's like, hey, you know what? I'm just I'm 
I'm just going to come up here, hang out, have a few drinks and get a dance. And then the next thing you know, like one of them was like, yeah, well, I'm going home. I'm like, wait, what the, f how did this happen? I didn't even try, bitch. What? <laughs> you watching these simps, you're watching simps over there dropping like three, four grand. And I'm just like, a bitch, get away from me. And they're like, I'm going to come home with you. I'm like, no, bitch, get away. I met, I, I, I met a guy like that who was just like, yeah, man, I'll buy, I'll, I'll buy you a dance. I'm like, all right, cool, man. Buys me, buys me like two dances with, with this one chick. I'm just like, that's weird. Because apparently he knows them all by name and their birthdays and like comes by on their birthdays and buys them, gives them more money and shit. I'm just like, that's all right, man. I, I hung. I had a couple buddies like that when I was like uh, 19. They were like, they were uh, brothers. One was 25 and one was like 26 and they owned a bar. And we would go to the uh, the Deja Vu, which was about an hour away. And um, yeah, that's like I, I hooked up with like two or three of the girls there back. Like I said, this is like what, 2000 and uh, one, 2000, you know, so we're talking a long time ago, long motherfucking time ago before I was married. OK, motherfuckers, you'll keep it scored at home, bitches. All right. I got married in 2011. The long <laughs> motherfucking time like Bernie Mac. Long time ago. Lo long, long time ago. <laughs> 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 anyway i'm gonna turn the camera off when my lawyer catches on <laughs> <laughs> all right so before we get pete in any more trouble than he's already in we're gonna bring it to a close if nobody else has anything else uh remember trashy movies review a rule make sure you hit that thumbs up for us and subscribe to the channel i'll be back next week with all kinds of crazy stuff you guys have yourselves a wonderful wonderful weekend oh my god